Hear me out here, guys. It's been stuck in my head. Alanis Morissette voice, okay? What it all comes down to is that everything is going to be fine, fine, fine. Because I got one hand on my penis and the other one is squeezing my ball sack. What do you think? I got one hand on my ball sack and the other one's jerking off to... You gotta, you gotta find the right series of words to go at the end. Cause I got one hand on my ball sack and the other one is tickling my asshole. Like this could, this could work, man. I'm soft, but I'm gooning. I'm hard, but I cannot come. I'm, <laughs> I'm a shower, but it's frigid, baby. Because what it all comes down to is that everything's going to be fine, fine, fine. Because I got one hand on my ball sack. And the other one's tickling my asshole. There we go. There we go. I knew it was in there. Oh, man. <clears throat> They're running Young Sheldon ads on your stream. You are so cooked. Guess what, buddy? You're watching Young Sheldon ads on my stream. I'm getting paid. That's CBS money. That's that less moon vest paycheck, bro. That shit comes on at like 7.30 p.m. on a Wednesday. Only people watching it have a net worth of like eight figures. Yeah, sure, it's 98% their house, but still. Bazinga. Um, okay, what are we doing today? We're going to do uh, the dolls. And as you may have heard, if you watched Kate's stream yesterday, we are away next week. We're on vacation. Starting on Friday. I will be gone Friday. Obviously, Saturday, Sunday. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Saturday, Sunday. Coming back on Monday. So we'll be fitting in Balatro while we can. Two things, oh my God. First off, I had that Balatro run. I'm not going to regale you too much with the war stories. I got like 4.38 times E to the 17. How did it happen? Long story short, I'm, I'm going to keep the engine, um, like I, I'm going to keep it as short as possible. Using DNA, I turned my entire deck into purple seal steel aces. Uh, and then I had mime blueprint blueprint. Mime makes every card in hand trigger again and blueprint copies the effect and it does chain off of itself. Then I had seven double tags and I skipped a blind that gave me plus three hand size next round. So I drew like 24 purple seal steel aces uh, and played f four of a kind because it had my highest mult. So I had like 21 or something steel aces in hand that each got triggered three times. I was running the numbers. It was something like, it was like one, my, my mult got multed by like 1.5 to the power of 60, <laughs> which is a lot. The, I don't know, the molt was like into the billions, I think. The chips were a little light, but the molt was into the billions, I think. It was some good stuff. Have you figured out what E means yet? Yeah, I figured out what it means functionally. It means that uh, Local Thunk designed the UI, and then people started getting scores that were too high, and he figured out he had to get some scientific notation in there.
E probably means you should go outside, but it feels so good when the numbers start popping out of the damn UX. <laughs> When's it coming out? Unknown. You'll have to watch every single Balatro uh, video all the way through in order to figure out which one it is. I already do. Let's freaking go! Hello. Oh, the second thing? Mm, no big deal. Just a new 60-minute PB on the Peloton. Big ups to uh, the Adriatic Highway in Croatia. Nice little scenic ride. Hello. Hey. <laughs> 2008 You can hear it, right? Yes. Oh, this is just dance. No, no, uh yes, it's just dance. Come on. Come on, come on. That's like that's too easy. Bass goes crazy on that. I mean, I mean it's, I'm not mad that it's too easy. It's nice that it was easy. Sometimes, uh, you know, it's a song I've never heard. Ooh. Spin that record, baby. Do just dance. Gonna be okay. Okay, that's a good one. It's a good. I like Lady Gaga. You know. I was going to say as much as anybody, but that's not true. <laughs> that's not true at all. Lots of people like her more than I do, but I like her okay. She's in Joker too. Oh, you mean uh, Joker de Un Petit Beaujolais pour les enfants, s'il vous plaît? Yes, okay. C'est vrai. C'est business. C'est business. C'est juste orange. Puis je l'ai à la salle de bain, s'il vous plaît. I thought that was Dynamite by Ty Cruz. Mm. I had a weird French moment uh, when I was picking up my daughter from a class. A mother held the door open for me and uh, I said, thank you. And then she kept walking and then she turned around like three seconds later and she said, Parlez-vous français? And I didn't know how to respond. So my dumb ass said, non. Like, non. And then she said, uh, oh, I thought I heard you say merci. And I said, oh, no, sorry. And then I was chiding myself. I was like, why did I say, oh, no, sorry in English? She doesn't speak English. And then I remembered that she said in English, I thought I heard you say merci. And I was just like, this is just, we got to scrap this one and go again. Like, nothing about this arrangement worked out at all. <laughs> it was cooked from the get-go. Hey, can I tell you another story? I think my brain is melting down. I swear to you it's 100% true. I had a dream last night that I was eating goldfish, like goldfish crackers. Uh, I woke up and put my Bluetooth earbud in my mouth as if it was a goldfish cracker. And then, like, as soon as it touched my lips, it was like a, a jolt of adrenaline. My brain went like, whoa, buddy, like, let's get some more uh, blood in your brain right now. Like, let's, let's get the alpha brainwaves cooking here. You almost just killed yourself by swallowing your Bluetooth earbud. And I was like, <sighs> the heart rate probably went up to like 150. I was like, <sighs> <sighs> and then I was like, I don't think I'm going to be able to get back to sleep. 15 seconds later, <sighs> shoo, <laughs> shoo. That's scary, man. You don't have, like, control of your brain when you're sleeping. That, that would have been the, the worst way to die of all time. Maybe I wouldn't die, but, like, I'm sure it's not good for you. It's all sorts of fucking plastics and rare earth metals and shit. <laughs> <laughs> 
Chubby Emu already did the video where someone ate an AirPod. What happened though? Are they okay? They died. They died. It exploded inside of them. I mean, it does have some kind of battery in it, right? Their throat got corroded by the battery. They presented to the emergency room. Okay, fucking chat GPT ass nurse. We love eating lithium, don't we people? We do, we do. Me swallowing a lithium ion battery and then farting a flamethrower out of my anus. Doesn't lithium react with air? Like on contact, I don't know how much <laughs> lithium is in a lithium battery, but I did do high school chemistry, folks. I did. I didn't like it, and I did not inhale. <clears throat> Slash marker. Dolls. Here we are, gamers. This is so doable. Pokedoku, monotypes, dual types, final evolutions. I'm not calling nine, though it could happen, but I'm calling easy eight here, okay? Dual type ground, Swampert. This is our go-to ground water. Dual type ghost. Hang on, I gotta think about that. Maybe Gengar, because he also has poison ability. Monotype ghost. Let's, let's start simple. Monotype fire, Charmander. That's a gimme. Final evolution of fire. I mean, what about you ever hear about the evolution of dance? How about Mag Mortar? You ever hear of this unit? Dude's like a 1980s professional wrestler. The final evolution of ground. In hindsight, perhaps should have saved Swampert for this one. But ground, there's no shot that Groudon is not ground. His, his name is an anagram for on ground. He has no evolutions. Bro, he is the, that's the final evolution, man. Ex does not include Pokemon without an evolutionary line. Then what the hell is primal, bro? How you know a tort lawyer made Poke Doku? Okay, still, the eight would be suitable. Monotype ground, Diglett. The one exception that ground type Pokemon don't live in the ground. Monotype ghost Pokemon. No, Gumi is. I don't even know what Gumi is. Let's be serious. Is this a bong Pokemon? Varum? For, for tobacco use only? Um, final evolution of a ghost Pokemon. Chandelure. Dual type ghost Pokemon. Gengar. Monotype ghost Pokemon. I'm going to hit you straight up. It's got to be Ghastly, bro. Ghastly's not poison. Is he flying? Is he ghost flying? Check. Can I get a check here? He's poison? He has no... He's purple. He's literally poison gas. He's literally made up, for one. So he's literally nothing. He's literarily poison gas, maybe. There's nothing literal about him. He comes before Gengar. Sometimes they, they add in another type, bro. Sometimes they add in another type. Like Charmander's a monotype fire. And then Charmeleon's monotype fire. And then Charizard, they're like, guess what? G is flying now. You're right, they sometimes do. If no one got me, I know Origin got me when I'm right. Some people in chat are dyed in the wool haters. Even if I'm right, they're like, you're wrong. Some people in the chat are dyed in the wool stands. They're like, even when I'm wrong, they're like, I'm right. Origin is the, the enlightened centrist. When I'm right, he tells me I'm right. When I'm wrong, he tells me I'm wrong. That's my barometer.
Gasly was just Ghost in Gen 1? Well, well, well. Perhaps a bit more sodium chloride next time. No, he wasn't? Oh, well, well. Lies, lies. In my Twitch chat, it's more likely than you think. Okay, dual type fire, Charizard. We just said it. I feel like seven was a bit of a throw. Forget about this. Like, listen, I don't know Typhlosion Hazui. I don't know Darmanitan Galar Zen. I don't know Aegis slash Shield. This is from Dota. Um, Misdreavis, I could have gotten. So her ass is purple, but not uh, poison. Okay. And she flies, but she's not flying. Sure, no problem. Grudon... Grudon Primal. Okay, I got, I got annoyed for a second because I thought that this was this one. That's fine. No big deal. I did Grudon down here. That was my mistake. Grudon Primal. Least common. Swinub. That, that's a tough... Oh, yeah, that's a... Hey, oh, why would you say uh, Swinub? Mammal Swine is an ice Pokemon. Listen, you so-and-so. They had duo types in evolutions all the time. What the heck is Basque Legion male? Or Wormadam Sandy? <laughs> I, I'm going to be real with you. I kind of, I'm vibing with uh, Colossal. Don't get me wrong, but Wormadam Sandy. It's, what is it, like a piece of pizza with a bird on it? Like, what is it? It looks like a piece of frozen pepperoni pizza. Why not regular pizza? Regular pizza... Um, is much more of an isosceles triangle. They almost, equilateral is a frozen pizza. When you cut a frozen pizza into quarters, a pizza that you get from a pizzeria delivered will be more isosceles than this, without a doubt. He's right, you know. Sorry, I'm just trying to, I'm, I'm building my, uh, my first Netflix stand-up special. I'm writing it. <laughs> They love the frozen pizza bit. They, they, you ever notice how when you get a pizza from the store, it's cut into eights, but when you get a frozen pizza, you can only cut it into quarters? So true. By the way, I am doing the voice of Mater in um, Cars 4. I'm pretty excited about it. What is the deal with airline food? Brother, I honestly, God is my witness. I think they're trying their best. I mean, they got a lot of things to, you know, get under control. They're flying an airplane. They got 200 people on it. They got all their luggage and stuff like that. And then people are like, oh, my ratatouille doesn't taste fresh. And you're like, brother, listen. I'm not saying you have to go like, thank you for the ratatouille, but let's at least like, you know, keep our, <laughs> keep our priorities straight here. <laughs> Microwave mac and cheese tastes eight times better. Well, yeah. Are you buying like 15,000 servings of it a day and then loading it onto like a metal cylinder where 250 people get served by three underpaid individuals who fucking hate you? Yes? All right. Well, I, don't, I apologize. I wasn't familiar with your, uh, with your game. I still think, like, being a flight attendant is, like, a crazy job. It's like, when the plane takes off, 80% of your job is being, like, a server, but 0.001% of the time, you're expected to basically be, like, a, a paramedic <laughs> or... <laughs> I don't know if you're expected to sacrifice your life for passengers' lives, but, like, if things go wrong, it's like you are not a waiter anymore. You are, like, priority number one project manager for saving as many lives as possible. I feel like if, if shit goes down, like, inside of the Cactus Club Cafe, I'm not going to turn to the server and be like, what do we do? <laughs> Everybody in the restaurant, uh, bracing positions. Happy birthday to you. Happy... Okay. Anyway, Framed. This is a movie in England, also known as The Italian Job. Okay, that's just about the only one I know. Uh, James Bond on Her Majesty. Okay, all right. 
Mm, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Let's go next. Looks like a 1970s movie is set in England. We go next. The Blaney Bureau. I, I don't know the actor. Poirot. It's probably Spirited Away, if I had to guess. Hmm. I don't know you. This man is 31 years old. I still have absolutely no idea. I could not tell you in the slightest. I cannot even hazard a guess. Um, this is The 400 Blows by Francois Truffaut. The answer is Frenzy. I've never heard of it, to be honest. Um, I'm not saying it's bad. I'm just saying I am completely unfamiliar with it. Wasn't it like The Flash on Monday? <laughs> I need that. Give me some more of The Flash. Hey, NL, you should play. Hang on. Vulture Cinematrix. It's movie grid, but better. Okay, hang on. Vulcan, Vulcan Matrix. Can I get a... I, I need another check on that one. Vulture Cinematrix. I don't know what happened to my brain. Vulture Cinematrix. It's loading. Dude, puzzles are having a, a fucking renaissance, huh? Someone also made Actor Doll, where you get the... You try to guess the movie based on the cast. Please uh, link this to me after I finish this. That sounds like it's right up my alley. I would play like 10 movie grids a day. I love movie grids, bro. Is there an extra special secret to this puzzle? I guess there's, these are themed. Because Tilda Swinton, Adrian Brody, Owen Wilson. I mean, this is, this is Wes Anderson, Pilden. There's Wes Anderson. Tilda Swinton, Oscar-nominated film. Lots of options there. I'm going to keep it simple. I'm going to go tar on that one. Tar was not nominated for any Oscars. That's Kate Blanchett, isn't it? That's Kate Blanchett. <clears throat> Release year 2000 to 2009. A little deep cut. A lot of people don't know that uh, Tilda Swinton's in Vanilla Sky, but she is. She is people. Tilda Swinton, Wes Anderson. Perhaps his best film, in my opinion. The Grand Budapest Hotel. I don't want to get into arguments here. Now, let's just leave this for a second. Adrian Brody, directed by Wes Anderson. Obviously, lots of options here. I'm going to simmer on that for just a second. Right, we probably end up playing Darjeeling Limited, even though it's going to be number one, I assume. Adrian Brody release 2000 to 2009. We go splice mode on that and hope it's not from 2010. Owen Wilson, 2000 to 2009. I'm a simple man. Let me get Starsky and Hutch. A little higher percentage than I would have. I would, have, I would think Zoolander's high. I would think, um, oh, you know what? Maybe Meet the Parents. Meet the Parents could have gone off. A lot of people forget that Owen Wilson's in that one. Yeah. Sorry. Um, Owen Wilson, directed by Wes Anderson. So I, I'm assuming the people that play this are smart. So you go uh, Bottle Rocket. People are going to be like, mm-mm. Bottle Rocket is going to be the first pick for people thinking that they're good at this. So what we do is, he's not in Rushmore. It's the other two Wilson brothers are in Rushmore. The other, Wil the other Wilson is Owen Wilson. Excuse me, no. The other Owen Wilson plays the gym coach at Rushmore Academy, okay? Check the IMDb page before you embarrass yourself. <clears throat> I'm just thinking about where we would like to go. Okay, listen. Me, personally, I go Bottle Rocket. I hate to do it, but I think Royal Tenenbaums and Darjeeling Limited are going to have higher percentages. Oh, I should have gone with my gut. <laughs> Hey, Fail Gunner, thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. Thank you. That hurts. Owen Wilson, Oscar-nominated film.
probably got to go with like Shanghai Nights on that one. Okay. Adrian Brody, Oscar nominated film. Call me crazy on this one. I'm going to say The Pianist. The other one, am I crazy to think that maybe King Kong got nominated for like special effects or something? I don't know if he's been in any other Oscar nominated films, honestly. Well, no, probably the Grand Budapest Hotel, now that I think about it. <laughs> then we play Darjeeling. And then we play Tilda. Why, why am I struggling so much to think of a Tilda Swinton Oscar nominated film? She's like the, perhaps the most glazed actress of our generation. Her and Kate Blanchett. Tilda Swinton, bro. 3,000 Years of Longing. Nominated for uh, Weirdest Movie to Feature a TED Talk. No! Seven of Nine. Oh, seven of Nine! Star Trek Deep Space Nine! Cars for Owen Wilson. That's, that's a good play, honestly. That was Voyager. Oh, whatever. <laughs> Acted.wtf. Here we are. Brother, this is too easy. I like it when it's a little, a little hard. <laughs> this is fucking Shrek 2, boy. Julie Andrews, Eddie Murphy, Antonio Banderas, John Cleese is Shrek 2, my dude. It's Shrek the third. <laughs> it's still good, though. Still good. That's a fun game. Dude, I, I gotta... Hang on. Let me control D these. These are good dolls, man. I love movie dolls. I'm sorry. It's basically like we took the Sporkle movie quizzes that I was doing and then made it so I could not be cyberbullied for just playing them. And then the Cinematrix. Please add it to my dolls collection. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Take me back to the Daily Dozen. You think it's Sporkle HQ? They're like scrambling right now. We have to release our own doll. Daily puzzles are popping off. Did you see the traction? New York Times connection is up 11,000% on social this week. Reinvent the trivia format and have it on my desk by Friday. Brandon Stokely was one of three wide receivers to total over 1,000 receiving yards on this 2004 AFC South team. Easy, bro. Falcons. It can't be the Falcons because the Falcons were, they played the Patriots in the Super Bowl. And the Patriots are in the AFC. 2004, who was airing it out in 2004? The Chiefs were airing it out in 2004. Trent Green was throwing bombs. Phillip Rivers, maybe, on the Chargers. Drew Brees on the Chargers before that. John Bryan on the Keys right now. Okay. Chiefs. All right. Wrong. Who was it? Colts. Colts are in the AFC South. You know, Indianapolis is like 10 seconds from the Canadian border. And Kansas City is like, 400 miles south of that. <clears throat> it said AFC South, brother? Bro, Kansas City is fucking way more south than Indianapolis, bro. I don't care what uh, Roger Goodell drew the lines of the fucking American map as in the NFL. I'm talking about longitude and latitude, brother. We hold these truths to be self-evident. This Brooklyn Nets shooting guard shot 44% on three-pointers, led the NBA in three-point percentage twice, and won the 2019 three-point contest. Who is uh, a short guy who's still six inches taller than me? I'm going to say Splash, <laughs> just praying that they named him after his abilities. Brooklyn Nets, Brooklyn Nets. 2000, well, I mean, like, was he on the Nets the whole time? If he was on the Nets the whole time, I got no chance. 
If he was on the Nets uh, for a little while, it could be Kevin Durant. All right. Joe Harris. All right, Joe Harris. Who knows? I would not have known that. The U.S. women's national team lost to this country in penalties in the 2011 Women's World Cup final. It's a given. All right, I guess it's Sweden. My mistake. Japan. All right, all right. Not so great on the sports. Living from uh, 1922 to 2007, this writer is named Kurt Vonnegut. That's Jack Black's head. Now that face is going to take me a second, but that's definitely Jack Black's head. And then the face is... The face is a man I've never seen before. I, I'm going to, this is a huge, I'm, it's Sasha Baron Cohen. That's all I can think of is that it's just from the eyes. Oh, Joe Mangianello. Yeah, I can totally see Joe Mangianello. Oh, I can see Joe Mangianello. I can see his eyes, man. I think you're right. I think it's Joe Mangianello. Along with their signature sauce, this major fast food chain offers Polynesian sauce. Their take on a sweet and sour sauce, except with a more liquid consistency. What is chick fillet? Is this even spelled right? I thought it was C-H-I-K. Or maybe I'm thinking of the ads. This drama starred Jeffrey Donovan and Bruce Dern as it followed a former CIA agent who had been fired and cut off from the legitimate world. What is burn notice? I, I thought that that starred Bruce Campbell, though. What the heck is Bruce Dern doing there? Big Lebowski starred who as one of the Lebowskis? That would be Jeff Bridges. I chimed in with you. Haven't you people ever heard of closing a gosh darn door is a recurring lyric from the uh, song, which is called... Listen, I was listening to songs from the Queen Mary at this point. Um, I think it's called I Write Sins, Not Tragedies. Is that correct? Yes, okay. (laughs) I don't know if I could name another Panic! at the Disco song until they came out with High Hopes in like 2018. Well, we recovered a little bit. I got to see if you could show me the correct answers. It is Joe Mangianello. (laughs) Oh, nine in the afternoon. Your eyes are as high as the moon. You could because you can't because we do. The song, one of the songs you play once in Rock Band 2 and then never play again. Yeah, 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 I know what you're talking about. I played it a lot in Rock Band. No disrespect. Were you asked at the virtual instruments? Your ass really going to play the expert guitar track on nine in the afternoon? Dun, 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 dun. You could be going... Nobody going to take my car. I'm going to race it to the end. Nobody going to take my car. I'm going... Ooh, she's a killing machine. She's got everything. You know what? Like, there's, there's phrases interlinked there, bro. You, you can't be wasting your time with nine in the afternoon. Now, I'm not saying you got to go Judas Priest painkiller on this. You know, you might scare the hose, but you could, you could at least bring some heat. What was I talking about? Kansas City and Indianapolis are within, are within one degree latitudinally. Okay. Simple question. Which one's more north and which one's more south? Me describing how close things are? Yeah, yeah. They're only off by one degree of latitude. Yeah, they must be really close as soon as you start using latitude as the measure of distance. 
Most people would be like, it's a 10 minute walk. I'll be like, well, within the context of the size of the earth, it's pretty small. <laughs> it's like when, I, when my daughter asks if our errand is going to take a long time. Well, I'm like, in the cosmic sense, no, humanity's only existed for the blink of the universe's eye. In a literal sense, on the time scale that's actually relevant to human beings, yes, it will be, you know, I don't know, like 0.05% of your entire life on planet Earth so far, but you're pretty young, so, you know, don't worry about it too much. Now, let me think. Cuban sandwich, Swiss cheese, st stiletto cheese, <laughs> wedge, stiletto. These are two kinds of high heel shoe. Double date, double jeopardy, double Dutch, double space. Things you can double. Javelin, pole, hammer. See, this one feels like the, uh, this feels like the red herring to me. Because obviously, these are four events in the decathlon. But these are three things you throw. Which means this doesn't match as well as the others. Now, I'm not saying it, it can't be right. It just doesn't feel right to me right now. Swiss cheese. A wedge salad. Kitten, pole, hurdle, jack, hammer, jack. Let's think about this. Let's think about this. Hammer, hammer, wedge. Are these like simple machines? American woman, get away from me. Cuban sandwich. Ah, whoa, whoa, whoa. Nationalities. Demonyms for nationalities. No! What? Maybe that's the red herring. Pole, hammer, hurdle, javelin, events in the decathlon, track and field equipment. All right. American cheese, Swiss cheese, blue cheese, jack cheese. What the heck is this? Cheeses familiarly. <laughs> Are these different types of heels? I've never heard of a kitten heel. Kinds of heels. Okay, there you go. Not, not that tough today. I, I fell for the classic red herring that wasn't a red herring. It was just a herring. I should have brought it onto the boat. I don't know about Cuban heels. I know more about Cuban links, which I think is... It's gold. It's gold. It's like a gold chain you wear around your neck. That's correct. I know a lot about hip-hop culture. Iced out? Mm, I wouldn't consider Cuban links to be part of being iced out. Uh, I consider ice more uh, colloquially associ associated with diamonds. I'm not going to say that gold and diamonds don't go together, but, but ice, mm, I wouldn't think so. No, no, no. You can add ice on the Cuban links. I suppose if you're going for something a little bit swagged out. I prefer to be a, a little more classic style. Where Goldilocks is discovered by the three bears. Bed. In your face. Overt. Losing player in the 2024 Super Bowl. 49er. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. Purdy. Fly like a flying squirrel. Glide. Something's not right here. One of the three stooges, Mo. Okay. Nerdy. I'm assuming this is evil. Jeans material, denim. Niner! Okay. Niner. There we go. He 
was right. I was. I don't know why I put numbers in it though. I was like four nine ERS. Glide redo tree something a kid might draw with brown and green crayons. People online be like, I just can't solve these New York Times puzzles. These New York Times puzzles are too hard. Something a kid might draw with brown and green crayons. <laughs> Sorry. Why not losing team instead of losing player? Well, because the Niner is not the name of the team. A Niner is, is a member of the 49ers, colloquially. Cheese is familiarly. Most of us have no clue what that would be. Then maybe, no disrespect, maybe puzzles aren't your, aren't your bag. Maybe you'd be better off doing like a Sudoku or something like that. Leave the word puzzles to the word cells. Shape rotators, like not everything in the word cell puzzles is going to make sense. It's the same way you show me, you know, three orthographic projections of a, the back of a truck and say, it's simple. How many fucking cubes are on it? I'm like, I don't know. A full load? Otherwise, I'm assuming they'd put more. They're like very cute. Actually, the answer is 51. Well, actually, the answer is you can't know, but we can make assumptions that indicates that the domain means it's a minimum of 51. And I'm like, okay, buddy, how about you do that? I'm going to go do Wordle today. Creamy canola fry shortening. 35 pounds of Greg's creamy canola fry shortening. Shit comes in a fucking cardboard bag. <laughs> I've never seen that before in my life. 35 pounds of fryer oil. With God as my witness, I have no idea. Um, canola oil is pretty cheap. I think this might be twenty three dollars and ninety nine cents. I don't own a diner, so this one is is a little bit outside of my my uh, uh, knowledge, my understanding, my area of familiarity. It was forty nine ninety nine. Someone in chat said fifty bucks. They got it right off the bat. Holy. I buy two of these a month. No, you, that's, do you run a prison? Like, me coming home from Costco with 35 pounds of creamy canola fry shortening. But think about it, we'll never have to buy creamy canola fry shortening ever again. It's 35 pounds for the price of 30 pounds. Mm, Bulgaria. Latvia. Hmm. Hmm. Azerbaijan. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Kazakhstan. Hmm. Afghanistan. Hmm. Bangladesh. That's cooler. That's too far. I honestly thought you were here, which does not make sense. Hmm, Nepal. Hmm, I thought you were there too, to be honest with you. Iran. <laughs> Lebanon. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Turkmenistan. Hmm. Tajikistan. Hmm. Kyrgyzstan. Hmm. <laughs> Uzbekistan. Hmm. 
<laughs> really delightful. Hmm. 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 India. Hmm. <laughs> I'm losing it. <laughs> How can it be? So it's Iran is closest, then Afghanistan, and then fucking India is eighth closest. It doesn't make any sense, bro. Hmm. Oh man. Hmm. <laughs> Saudi Arabia. Hmm. Egypt. Hmm. <laughs> Turkey. Hmm. <laughs> Syria. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Palestine. Hmm. Iraq. Oh, Bahrain. Oh! <laughs> 22 guesses. You know what got cooked up here? Things got very confusing geographically because of the freaking whatever this incredibly important body of water is called, the Persian Gulf. That's, that's the Red Sea? Nah, bro. Like, this is the Red Sea, right? Because, like, it, this gulf caused the geography to not make sense to me. Because I was like, how can it be close to, like, you and you, but you're so far away? It's because of the Indian Ocean, brother. Holy, it's not like your ass was coming out with Bahrain right off the back. Like this country, like it doesn't, it's smaller, no disrespect. I know it has a GP, um, but it's smaller and that makes it better than me, <laughs> by the way, because I don't know well, I have one, but we don't see her very often. Um, it's smaller than the distance between uh, Indianapolis and Kansas City. It's less than one degree of, of latitude in its entirety. This is bad. What about Vancouver to LA? I'm calling it. That's three degrees right there. This no, no, this is not bad. This is like um it's this is Latvia, bro. Yep. This is Suriname. It's got to be something on the north coast of South America. Or set. Buddy, you think I don't recognize Panama when I see it? That's where the canal goes through right there. Are you, are you, maybe you're in the Caribbean islands, okay? At the 100th Caribbean, where the Great Plains begin. Any chance your ass is like Antigua and Barbuda? It looks like there's two Andes there. Okay, no, 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 no. What about Wedge and Antilles? <laughs> Dominica? Any chance you would be Trinidad and Tobago? Haiti! What? Isn't Haiti like half of the country that is the Dominican or half of the island that the other half is the Dominican Republic? What? It, what, what it doesn't, look, it doesn't look right to me. It doesn't look right to me. Am I looking at the wrong half? This is the west half? Looks like a damn crab trying to get a piece of plankton. Look at a map. No, I don't think I will. 
I thought that the border was like a, I thought it was like a straight line. Just to be honest with you, I don't have a, a rigorous knowledge of the regularity or irregularity of all international borders. NA people be like, it's true. Canada and the US is literally just a line. They fought for a long time and then they're like, ah, oh, whatever. Split it down the middle. Tell that to Maine? Okay, I will if they take the lobsters out of their ears. <clears throat> so true, so true. <laughs> What are you going to do? Come over here and get me? It's a long ass flight, bro. Plus you're starting in Maine. So you probably got to take a commuter jet to like a fucking major airport. Depending on the airport, it might not even fly directly here. It might take you like four flights just to get over here. You're not going to be angry by the time you land. You're going to be tired. You should be. You should get, you get some sleep. 1985. I was not alive. Flight voice. Man, I won't even be alive then. Starring Clint Eastwood. Simmer that one for a second. 20th Century Fox fell 7% in its second weekend. Starring Don Amesh. It is everything you've dreamed of. It's nothing you'd expect. Directed by Ron Howard. But it's not Splash. It's Cocoon. Did... did Ron Howard, he did! Where was that knowledge in my brain, bro? I didn't know that I knew that Ron Howard directed Cocoon. But something in, up here knew that Ron Howard directed Cocoon. That's, the human mind is a crazy thing, man. I don't even know who Don Amesh is. And honestly, I probably would have gotten it on number two, but still. That's crazy. Six week fell 4%. Starring Sylvester Stallone from 1985. I gotta be honest, that feels like a First Blood Part 2 to me. One of the at most absolute insane covers I've ever seen. I feel like the man is holding a, a light machine gun with a rocket tip on the end. <laughs> So true, this 97-year-old streamer still constructs mind palaces the old-fashioned way. My reaction when the 97-year-old diner no longer makes coke the old-fashioned way. No! Oh. Honey, do you want to join the Columbia Picture Company? Just opened. Emilio Estevez, 85. Gotta call this Young Guns. Tagline, the passion burns deep. Simmer on that one for a second. Warner Brothers, $40 million at the box office starring Sean Astin. Gonna have to say it must be Rudy. That's a problem. The Goonies, 1985, The Goonies. The Goonies, okay, that makes sense. This is like Dan would clear me in this puzzle. No doubt about it. I don't know if he's getting cocoon though. And hell followed with him. Dirty Harry came back. Sudden impact and hell came with him. Actor two. <laughs> I'm not going to know who Michael Moriarty is, man. A mysterious preacher protects a humble prospector village from a greedy mining company trying to encroach on their land. Unforgiven. Hi, Tomo. Directed by Clint Eastwood. And hell followed with him. Heaven came back. Came back. They, five, they came, they came back and hell followed with him. All right. You know what? Let's see what we're dealing with. Emilio Estevez, Rob Lowe. This Young Guns 2. Reveal all hints. A group of friends graduates from the halls of Georgetown University into lives that revolve around sex and career aspirations. Kirby's in this? 
I don't know what this movie is. I should. I've heard of St. Elmo's Fire before, but I don't know. I've never seen it. Fair enough. And this one's just pissing me off. Pale, okay, I'm not getting Pale Rider. <laughs> That's tough. <laughs> Elmo and Kirby? My parents love that movie. Springsteen, Madonna, way before Nirvana. And music still on MTV. Something like that, I don't remember. Not my favorite box office game, but it's not their fault I wasn't alive. What do you mean, question mark? It wasn't their fault I'm not alive. Unless my parents made that game, in which case I would commend them. Because A, they know a lot about movies, and B, I didn't know that my parents knew shit about like web development, quite frankly. I'm going to stop helping them set up their routers and shit. <laughs> they got me cleared. Ben Affleck, Jennifer Lopez, Al Pacino. That's Geely. U.S. Marshals. Uh, wait, wait, okay. Jennifer Lopez is in Out of Sight. U.S. Marshal is going to be Al Pacino, Prison Escape. At, whoa, whoa, but Ben Affleck is in How Do You Like Them Apples? What? Ben Affleck, Harvard, Apples. We can recover this. How many? We got 10 swaps, okay? We got 10 swaps. Everyone relax. Al Pacino. <laughs> Therapy. That's Goodwill Hunting. Christopher Walken, Hunter Vietnam. That's the deer hunter. He's in therapy probably, right? Never mind. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, this is bad. Our shit's cooked, boys. <laughs> I gotta rearrange it. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, man, don't talk. That, that one was cooked from the beginning. I don't, honestly, I don't even want to know. It's G. Lee. Yes, I knew it was the deer hunt. Oh, roulette. <laughs> it's the most famous scene in the movie. Jennifer Lopez, it's out of sight. Oh my God, in The Godfather. That one's embarrassing. That one, that one fell apart. Couldn't have just given us an easy movie, huh? Like White Chicks? First Bandle, now this? What are you talking about? we got it in too, bro. You are having hallucinations. I'm digesting the information first. Stop motion animation. Coraline, Anomalisa, Cubo in the Two Strings, Fantastic Mr. Fox. Mamma Mia, West Side Story, The Phantom of the Opera, and La La Land. These are musicals. Okay, let's get it done then. No reason to waste our time. Beautiful Boy, Little Women, Dune. These are Timothy Chalamet films. Devil Wears Prada, Zoolander, The Neon Demon. These are movies about the fashion industry. And then... 
Obviously, you got Daniel Day-Lewis. You got Ridden by Charlie Kaufman, directed by Nicholas Winding Refn, Ben Stiller, Owen Wilson, Meryl Streep, Stanley Tucci, um, Anne Hathaway, Emily Blunt. This is the, this, this is the connection that scares me the most. Because to be honest with you, I don't know shit about Kubo and the Two Strings, except that it's apparently very good. Gerard Butler, Emmy Rossum. Ryan Gosling, Emma Stone, J.K. Simmons. Directed by Steven Spielberg, Ansel Elgort, Rachel Zegler, and then the lady who said, Angela Bassett did the thing. Meryl St it's gotta be Meryl Streep, bro. It's gotta be Meryl, it's gotta be Meryl Streep, bro! Because she's in Mamma Mia. And her ass ain't in Dune. Let me tell you that. She's probably in Little Women. <laughs> what did I tell you? She's in Dune? Yeah, your ass probably thinks that she played the Bene Gesserit. Face blind motherfucker. We did it. Was I right? Is that lady from West Side Story, the lady who said Angela Bassett did the thing? Viola Davis, my woman king. Yes, it is her. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I can't believe that's more than a year old, man. Angela Bassett did the thing. Viola Davis, my woman king. Oh, man. Ariana DeBose. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. I didn't know. I can't get it out of my head now. Why did I do that to myself? Oh, man. She's good in that movie? She Honestly, I think Ariana DeBose, is the, it, she's the best actor in West Side Story, or at least she has the best performance. I don't like... West, I, I got to be careful with what I say, because I'm now carrying the torch of real cinema. Um, I know West Side Story is having a resurgence. People are mad that it was not a breakout hit, which makes sense because it was COVID to begin with. I saw it a month ago. I gave it a three and a no heart on Letterboxd. I'm sorry to say. Again, I, I, so I don't, I'm not, I, he went, Steve, Steven Spielberg swung for the freaking fences, okay? So like, I'm, I'm not mad about that at all. I just didn't fully vibe with it, especially the second half. First half, pretty good, bombastic, beautiful musical numbers. Unbelievable choreography. Second half, forced to be carried by Ansel Elgort and Rachel Zegler. And I'm Ansel Elgort, I'm personally inclined to say that he doesn't have the sauce based on what I've seen so far. Rachel Zegler, IMO, the jury is out, but I don't think she had the sauce in, in West Side Story. I'm not saying it's her fault. That's just my take. <clears throat> this is cursed. <laughs> this, <laughs> I'm sorry. It's the Henry Cavill's haircut, man. It gets me every time. It's crazy to think that's what motherfuckers were just looking like in like the 1950s, man. Like you'd be waving to this dude. He'd live next door to you. He'd be like mowing his lawn or cooking up burgers on like a, a red charcoal grill on the front porch. And then he would go to his job working for the Department of Defense, like building a satellite that could shoot a laser beam from outer space and destroy a city. Mid-century America, kind of crazy. I mean, look at the haircut, bro. Look at his hair. <laughs> look at his fucking hair. You think people were okay back then? Okay, well, let's be realistic. We have to get out of Doctor Who rather than get into it. Okay, I mean, there's, there's ways. There's certainly ways out of here. Ken Bone was in this movie? The, the prototypical undecided voter? Simon Fregg. Simon Fregg. Simon Pegg and Nick Frost had a baby. You won't believe what it looks like. You will believe its name. Okay, me personally, it's crazy that this is not the same person. 
just IMO. Um, I think that we're going to go... So we're trying to get the Agent Argyle. Simply put, Agent Argyle has too many people in it for me to narrow it down in my head. Dude, that Matt, Matt Smith picture is so funny. So it has Bryce Dallas Howard, Henry Cavill... Sam, you know what? Let's put some respect on Sam Rockwell, okay? Because he's been in a lot of great stuff. Let's connect to Sam Rockwell. So I'm thinking... Let's do a... Actually, I think I got a connection. John Hurt. Nebraska. Wrong Hurt. Okay, now we're in trouble. John Hurt. Indiana Jones and the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. Tilda Swinton, that's a callback. Now, let's try to get there, okay? <laughs> I'm so... I'm, why am I lost? Listen, I'll, can I just put some respect on my own name? Kate Blanchett, Thor Ragnarok, any actor. Uh, Infinity War, Robert Downey Jr., Iron Man 2, Sam Rockwell. But we're not going to be doing that to ourselves. We're not going to be doing that to ourselves. We're going to be playing Chet Hanks. <laughs> what movie am I even on? I'm on Indiana Jones. Okay. Chet Hanks was in this, huh? Can I just try something? Let's, let's learn something, okay? We'll go Chet Hanks. You got to put a little bit of respect, or maybe you feel the opposite. You know... I feel like Tom Hanks is trying to do right by his, by his son, right? <laughs> he's giving him a little bit of... He's giving him a push. He put him, he put him in Greyhound. Put him in Larry Crown. Bratz 2007. Where am I trying... Okay, I'm trying to get to Sam Rockwell. Mm -hmm. Sam Rockwell. Mm, yes, delightful. Sam Rockwell. We go Larry Crown. I don't know shit about where I am, to be honest with you. I'm scrolling, man. Okay, d do the hard work. Sam Rockwell, Matchstick Men, Nicolas Cage, Allison Lohman, Jojo Rabbit, Scarlett Johansson, Taika Waititi, Three Billboards, Francis McDormand, Woody Harrelson. Woody Harrelson. Zombieland. With Emma Stone. Emma. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. hang on. Brian Cranston. Little Miss Sunshine. I got it. I felt it crystallized. Little Miss Sunshine. Abigail Breslin. Zombieland. Emma Stone. Uh, Woody Harrelson. <laughs> Match to, uh, 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 three billboards. Sam Rockwell. Agent Argyle. We get there. I'll be back in just a sec. Brian Cranston is in Argyle? I wouldn't know that because uh, I don't watch movies my coworkers recommend. Brian Cranston is in Argyle, man? Sorry, I didn't realize we had a chat full of the world's number one Argyle fans. You guys must be super excited for the Matthew Vaughn cinematic universe. It was on the screen? You guys, I'm just being honest with you. You guys are being disingenuous. I bet 10 people in chat remember that Brian Cranston was on the poster and everybody else is like, you're right, he was. He was on the poster. What you don't realize 
is that you and me were actually in the same boat. Sir, it was on the screen. Okay, fucking scanning electron microscope eyes having ass. I can't even make out what the shit this is. Looks like a, a CGI shot from The Flash. It's a, a pixel by a pixel. If you love Argyle so much, fucking why don't you marry it? Maybe I will. I don't even know who the real Agent Argyle is. If I had to guess, I would assume that it's Henry Cavill because of that haircut and the fact that he's six foot two and built like a like a NFL linebacker. It has to be the cat. No shot, bro. That doesn't even make sense. He's built like a shit brick house. <laughs> Can I say, by the way, some things are worse than they were 80 years ago. One thing that's definitely better, it's fucking sick to have indoor plumbing, bro. Can you imagine waking up at like 2.30 a.m. and having to walk outside at like minus 10 degrees Celsius and then go shit in like a wooden hole <laughs> on, a, on a splintered chair with no heating at all? I get maybe they just went, maybe they just shit in like a, a pan next to the bed, but like that's way worse. Can you imagine? I don't know if I could do it, right? Like if I'm sleeping in bed with my wife, I don't even like to fart in front of her. Mostly because not like I'm embarrassed, I'm mostly just rude. Or I, I consider it rude to be like, I could go somewhere else and fart, but instead I'm gonna like fill the area that you're in with toxic gas. But I definitely don't think I could lean over the side of the bed and like take a dump at 2 a.m. and slide it back under the bed and then just go to sleep. <laughs> There's no way, man. I don't think, I mean, back in the day, I guess that was the norm, but I don't think I could have done it, man. <laughs> Plumbing is crazy. I, uh, this is don't starve, bro. It's the same as I can see the icons. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> oh, man. Hole in one. I can see the damn code on, on don't starve. We get, it's also like relatively top of mind because we guessed don't starve like 10 times yesterday. I know this shit. This is, this is, uh, Dirty Bomb. Okay, maybe it is Borderlands. Tales from the? It doesn't look like Borderlands. I don't know what the hell it could be. Um, um, uh, Scavenger's Reign? That's not even a game. It's a tactics, it looks like a tactics game to me. There was a tactics game. Oh man, give me a second. Give me, give me some more. Maybe, maybe it'll be obvious. I guess like the other thing I want to say is this is like Bro Force, but Bro Force doesn't have such a muted color palette. Um, that one hurts. I thought Bro Force, I mean, obviously the icon is a little bit more 1980s and 90s Americana. I didn't know it was this muted in the, in the artwork, but. Assassin's Creed 4. One day I'll learn how to spell. Skull and Bones. The world's first quadruple A game. <laughs> Skull and Bones. I didn't think that it was Skull and Bones from the first picture because it looked uh, good. 
That's my mistake. Skull and bones. Okay, we're wrong in basically every category. Uh, let's narrow it down. Let's pick a game from 2012. How about XCOM Enemy Unknown? Okay, that narrows down the time. Now let's pick a first-person shooter from 2018. How about, it's not 2018. How about Wolfenstein 2? 2. 2017, first person, single player. Now we're cooking something up. Now we're cooking something up. <laughs> Hi, Tomo. So it is an adventure. We know that. That's necessarily true. And it also has elements of these. Am I crazy to think that there could be a little escape from Tarkov in here? It is a Unity game. I guess Tarkov is definitely not single player. We know that now it's not Windows exclusive. First per let's, let's guess an indie game to see if it could possibly be in the independent genre. Unknown. Hi, Tomo. Hi, buddy. I believe this is made in... I could be wrong, but I thought that was... Not that it matters, I guess. 2017, single player, Unity, first person. I'm willing to, to let her rip. A shooter simulator strategy in the adventure game. It's a little game by the name of Rust, which I don't believe is made in Unity. But, okay, <laughs> it is made in Unity. At, I thought that was like early access release, but disregard. Shooter simulator strategy adventure indie action survival open world. And it's single player only. So I'm like, it's the long dark, but it came out four years after the long dark. Hi, Tomo. Shooter simulator strategy adventure, Andy. And it's first person. I mean, I'm just, I, I'm throwing out a guess that makes, okay. <laughs> I really thought that The Long Dark came out in like 2015. Stop scratching me, man. Stop scratching me. Guess the game. Game though. We accidentally the whole thing. So true. 1989 comedy. Liked by audiences and critics alike. The Three Amigos. All right. <laughs> this is probably not going to be The Three Stooges. Mild but pleasing, the movie, passing in time from the 50s through the civil rights period, lovingly measures the precise shadings of irritation, affection, and dependence that flow back and forth between two characters. What is driving Miss Daisy, bro? Yeah! I was washed in the middle, and now I'm fucking heating up at the end. I thought Forrest Gump was later. It is later. Also, it's two words. Sorry, I can't resist the opportunity to reflect back at chat some of the hurt that they've directed at me over the years. That's because it's not Forrest, Dump, uh, Forrest Gump, or as I call it, Forrest Dump. It's Driving Miss Daisy. Starring Morgan Freeman and that old lady whose name, let's be honest, nobody knows. Sorry. Jessica Tani, okay fucking pub trivia ass. Aware. 
A adjective meaning having or showing realization. Perfect. Clipper. A noun meaning one that clips something. Clipper. Wait, wait, wait. Well, I'm, I'm detecting, I'm detecting a theme. <laughs> Vocabulary. Mm, never mind. A noun meaning a list or cl Gander. A noun meaning an ad These are me words, bro. Because. Well, a conjunction meaning for the I do use that one a lot too, but I think a lot of people do. Dramatization. A noun meaning the action of drama. Habanero. <laughs> oh, no, dipped in Mama Liz's chili oil? Combination. A noun meaning a result. Very satisfying word to type combination. Adulation. A noun meaning agreement. A noun meaning. All right. Can we go back to back? Offspring. Yeah. A noun meaning. When she said. I don't know how to spell. Then I wonder why she's built with AI. Tuka, tuka, tuka. Sorry. Inchoate. A adjective meaning. Yeah, I have no idea what it means, but I've seen it written. Griffin. A noun meaning Brussels griffin. The word originates from French, where it literally translates. No! <laughs> Brussels griffin again. <laughs> oh. Corsair. A noun meaning pirate. Threnody, a noun meaning a song of lamentation for the dead. Elegy. Threnoidia is Greek, combining threnos, meaning dirge, and eating to sing. Threnody, a noun meaning a song of lamentation for the dead. Elegy. Threnoidia is Greek, <laughs> combining threnos, meaning dirge, and eating to sing. <laughs> Threnody. 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 It's not that. I was way off on that one. Griffin, 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 Griffin. What kind of three do you, do you guys want played at your funeral? I'll take, I mean, 13 out of 15 is okay. I've lost on two words that are hard to spell. I can't be too upset about that. Highway to hell. <laughs> Play some fucking long ass shit at my funeral, bro. Play like a 14 minute long song. We're not playing any 180 second long, you know, like What a Wonderful World or something like that. We're hitting them with like in the Court of the Crimson King or something. I want them to feel the suite of emotions. Rebecca Ferguson, three or more word title begins with the, released here. <clears throat> released from 2000 to 2024. Hercules, Hercules. Rebecca Ferguson, three or more word title. Mission Impossible. Fallout. Benedict Cumberbatch begins with the. The imitation. No, the penguins. No, the imitation game. The penguins of Madagascar. Operation Vacation. That's a no, huh? Oh, it's just called Penguins of Madagascar. <laughs> what a scam, bro. What a scam. That's all right. I wasn't going to get Rebecca Ferguson, the. The fuck else is Benedict Cumberbatch in, bro? Oh, Doctor Strange? <laughs> Which means he, he's definitely in Thor Ragnarok. That'll be the tricky one. Yeah. 2.4% on a Marvel movie. You got to admit, that's a pull. That's a bit of a pull when you could just easily go Doctor Strange instead. Christopher Walken, three or more word title. The Deer Hunter. Mm. Begins with the. The Deer Hunter.
three or more word title released from 2000 to 2024. Seven psychopaths. Christopher Walken, three or more word title. Batman Returns. Again! Christopher Walken. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm giving up. I'm, are you in the beguiled? I just got to check. We, gotta, we might as well throw a guess out there. She was not noted. Balls of Fury. <laughs> You're so right. Catch me if you can. It turns out there's a lot, actually. Turns out there's a lot. Where were we? Top 51%. That's got a sting. We got Lucien Boucharded. He is in the Wedding Crashers. He plays Senator whatever his name is. Food Guesser! I forgot about Food Guesser. A view to a kill! Oh. Dance into the fire. This is... I don't know. Black beans, pork shoulder, beef ribs, the inferior rib. No, I don't know. The, the LA Galbi goes kind of crazy. Bacon, smoked sausage, chorizo, onion, garlic, bay leaf, salt, black pepper, paprika, cumin, orange juice, and water. The use of chorizo has me thinking Spain, but it has also chorizo sausage has taken over the, the whole world. I got to try Spain, although the dish itself maybe looks more Mexican, American, Hungarian. 347 kilometers west of, okay, Portugal then. <laughs> it's a common name given to dishes from Portuguese-speaking countries. It, Portugal, Angola, holy cow, Macau. It does look yummy. I, I w will say, though, partly I think that it looks yummy because it's being cooked in the ultimate Le Crusette cast iron Dutch oven. You don't buy that type of cookware unless you're a good chef, I hope. I think the, the pot is doing much of the work. It doesn't look bad. Don't give me, I would eat it for sure. I liked every ingredient. A cauldron. <laughs> Beef, carrots, potatoes, corn, peas, pumpkin, cabbage, noodle, garlic, onion, tomato, oregano, cumin. It's a white soup. It's not from Ireland. Holy cow. Can I get the name for 100 points, please? Chiro. Chairo Sozer, Rolo Tamasi, Chairo. Uh, let's go Brazil. Let's go Argentina. Let's go Chile. Let's go Colombia. Bolivia. <laughs> That's tough, man. Chira, I've never heard of it. An Andean stew commonly found in Bolivia. You stumped me on. That's the first time I've been stumped, bro. A comfort food prepared in large quantities and shared among family and friends. Looks good. Don't get me wrong. Tamarind chilies, lemongrass, shallots, garlic, ginger, belican, turmeric, galangal, kefir, lime leaves, sugar, salt, fish, typically mackerel. This shit is Thailand, bro. 
It's Thailand. It's Malaysia. Assam Pedas, the wickedly talented Adele Dazim. Known for its sour and spicy flavors. It translates to sour spicy, reflecting the key flavors of the dish. The dish typically consists of fish cooked in a sour and spicy broth. Goes hard. It looks good. Don't get me wrong. I like fish. I'm a fish guy. Not my best food guesser, but life goes on. Okay, slash marker me. That's the dolls. Good dolls today. Let's farm some Bellatro. It's Bellatro season. We're just living in it. They love it. They love it. We got a new emote courtesy of Ghost Mop. Oh, Isaac! Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot. I need to add Isaac to the list, bro. Control D. Add it to the list. I'm so bad at Isaac, though. Okay, you ready? See, I no disrespect. I dislike buttons like this. Because does this mean if I click it, it goes mute? Or does this mean it is muted? And when I click it, it's now on. See what I'm saying, bro? You see what I'm saying? There's, there needs to be some kind of... Indi I speak for the everyman. There needs to be some kind of indication of its current status. Otherwise, because sometimes buttons say, like, on. That doesn't mean that when I press the button, it turns it on. That doesn't mean that it's on right now. But sometimes, like... Anyway, well, do you hear music? Well, we'll just wait until we hear Isaac go... Ah. Magic mushroom. Okay, it's muted. It's a passive item that came out in Rebirth. It is found somewhere. Easy. An item known as, <laughs> I'm looking around my room. Hmm, water bottle, Coke Zero, chocolate milk. Mm, okay, it is found in the item room and it does modify your tears. Epiphora. Hmm. <laughs> okay. All I got to do is think of other tier two items, even though I don't know what tier anything is. Hmm. Eve's. Mascara. Wrong. It is a black item that affects your tears. The silhouette. It's quite simple, really. It's a little brimstone. Well, well, well. <laughs> He's done it. We will become silhouettes when our bodies finally go. It does not affect your tears. Um, it makes me cry tears of happiness when I get it if I don't have a lot of damage because you can rely on little brimstone to carry you for quite some time. Not forever, but for some time. Facts. Holy cow. I had it open already. Look, look, we got antimatter for plus one joker slot. Hey, Anel. Well, you know what? <laughs> hey, Anel, you ever lose your shape trying to act casual? Um, it almost happened to me once, but then I realized I can't stop. I might end up in the hospital. I know what you're talking about. You know what? There's something wrong with my brain because I am sure that you brought it up to Bond about, um, you know, born under punches or whichever. Uh, that might be the second one. Cross-eyed and painless off of uh, Remain in Light. 
But for me, I took it as you trying to trick me. Trying to be like, oh, this guy says he loves Remain in Light. Let me ask him a question about the lyrics on Cross-Eyed and Painless without lampshading that it's about the lyrics to begin with. And you're not going to catch me on that one, okay? You're not going to catch me on that one. Are you locked in the punch? Okay, REM poster, that's Man on the Moon. Andy, are you tripping on Elvis? Hey, baby. Are you having fun? Three, two, four, if you believe. Sing it with me. They put a man on the moon. Yeah, man on the... Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry. Let's try uh, the Dean Norris deck. You got to think about that one. And we'll go red stake mode. I don't think I'll be re-rolling the boss blinds. Well, no, we'd rather, well, you know what? Ah, <laughs> sorry. Skip me. Anyway, what are you, the cards previously played or debuffed? That is better. Skip me again and give me 10 bucks in my pocket. And the other one's playing a piano. And then we got great full house potential immediately. I'm going to hold 8, 9, 10, queen. Never punished. All we gotta do is get through this boss, then the real game can start. The real Balatro starts here. Pair would give us... 44 points. It's not quite enough. I mean, it's enough to get us there in two hands, but we could also get there in one hand. Well, we could just do it like that instead. <clears throat> T-Tours. What's going on? Oh, because you want me to move my camera. I see. That's sensible. Sorry. You didn't miss it. It's just anti one. Don't worry about it too much. There you go. He understands symbolic language. Listen, right off the jump. Great voucher. No doubt about it. Uh, we can't afford to be too choosy. See if we get like a hermit, in which case we definitely should have done that before we bought the voucher, but life goes on. Hermit me. Um, give me a voucher that helps us. Give it a chance. Scott, that's a fantastic, that's unbelievable. I'll, I'll celebrate by ripping a pack. And you know what? For the time being, at least this card is somewhat augmented. Like that's, that's kind of sick, bro. I need to be careful. I would love a rare joker, but I have to build my money up first. I might just save my double tag on this one because I don't think I'll get enough money to purchase the rare Andrews. So this to me has the makings of a heart flush with some face cards backing us up. Because face cards are, I mean, worth an awful lot for us. Very nice. <clears throat> Cigarette tier, <laughs> cigarette tearless stream when? Well, I mean, it's just a matter of time, right? As I am always talking about smoking. I honestly have no, I, I wouldn't even know where to start. I wouldn't even know the criteria one would use to evaluate them. Let's try an 8, 9, 10, Jack, Queen. You're not even gonna gold me? Like, what are we doing here then? I guess I could just play my flush instead. There you go. It's vibes based. What is it about uh, drinking alcohol that makes people talk about cigarettes like they taste like a Baconator? As someone who's never smoked, I, what is like the, the mechanism for it? Both are vices? Yeah, but is there like, uh, you know how like you wouldn't eat ketchup by itself, but like you wouldn't eat french fries without it? Belgian people in chat are like, you said ketchup, do you mean mayonnaise? You should try it. I'm not gonna start smoking. <laughs> it's just, it's too late for that and it's one of the only times I've ever said that and recognized it as a positive. I'm still saving money, bro. I'm still saving my money. It's an incredible starting hand considering our, our jokers. All, all two Peria. 
You know what? If we're going to do that, we should play jacks, sevens, and then toss the ace alongside it. I would really like to see another face card. That's the wrong one, bro. I'm, I'm discarding pairs. Like, that's how much I believe in the cause here. I mean, I'll play 9-10 jack, queen, king. That's not so bad. Gotta play your flush. There you go. Smoking makes you cooler. I'm sorry to be like the ultimate millennial. I really don't feel that. I, I, I know people say that. But I, when I look at someone smoking a cigarette, I don't go, oh, that person's so cool. I don't go, whoa, like, fuck that person either. I just go like, you know, you don't see that too much these days. <laughs> I, in a way, I feel bad for the smokers. Because I feel like no matter where you smoke now, at least in North America, like, it's basically illegal. Like, I don't know how you could be a smoker and live in a big city. Because you can't smoke inside. And then if you, like, smoke on your balcony, all the people that live above you are going to be like, yo, bro, chill out. Like, you know, we're not trying to partake. And then if you go outside and do it, you can't do it, like, on the sidewalk because people are walking by. And then if you do it, like, too close to, like, an air intake, the building manager will come out and, like, break your kneecaps. Like, I don't know. What do you do, man? How do you do it? Vaping's even worse. I have to tell... I'm not trying to make you, like, feel bad. You do whatever you do. I'm sure there's lots of things I do that aren't cool. I walk on my toes, you know? In my head, I'm like uh, John Travolta from Saturday Night Fever. But when people see me, they're probably like, what the hell's wrong with that dude's legs? <laughs> But, like, I have to say, as the arbiter of consensus, vaping looks, like, really uncool. Now, is it better for you? It might be. I don't know. I'm not, a, I'm not Russell Crowe from the, in, the Insider, Michael Mann, 1999. But it kind of looks like you said, I want to smoke, but smoke tastes yucky. Can you give me something that tastes like a Tim Hortons donut? I'm just saying... That's just me. Now, I'm not saying quit vaping, start smoking. I'm just giving my opinion on the data points that I see around me. Now, one moment, please. You know, I think we need a stone card. Let's see what we get here. Uh, two negative jokers would take me to the stratosphere. And I might be able to afford them both. Ace, two, three, four, five. That's not good enough. <laughs> How about this one, though? Nine, ten, jack, queen, king. Now we're talking. Mm -hmm. uh, sorry, I need to discard and draw face cards. Sorry, I need to discard and I need to I need to draw more face cards. It needs to be face cards, bro. I see what we got a full house. The full house is gonna give us none face cards times 1.5. So let's see, it's gonna be 21, but it's gonna be like 37. It's gonna be 77 times six. That's only like 400 points. I don't think we can do it. I think we gotta do a little a little discard. With God as my witness, I actually think the play is two pair. At least two of them are face cards. And you got a stone card adding 50 chips. That was not good. We're cooked. <laughs> we, needed a, we needed a joker that added some mults. Not even remotely close. Skip for a double tag. I mean, this is a nice start. 24 bucks in my pocket. Hearts are debuffed. I missed the part where that's my problem. Probably still hold. Like a full house would be good enough. But if you guys are debuffed, we'd rather full house these Andes right here. 
play a pair to try to draw the full house. Better, closer, warmer. Yeah, some, I mean, it depends on how you play Balatro too. But like some runs, they're just not going to pop. And that's okay. It depends on your play style. But if you're if you're going for like lots of skips early, you're probably gonna flame out pretty frequently. But when it when it hits though, oh, <laughs> like these are horrendous jokers for us. Let's see, maybe a judgment would go insane. Hanged man. I think having a lucky card, you never know, could get you out of a jam. How about a good enhanced card? Red Seal Molt is kind of like that could save us, man. And we, we will not be doing that. And we're not even worried about Telescope right now. Let's add, li listen, we got something to build on. Add a stone to your deck when the blind is selected. Like, listen, I'm not going to lie to you. We got some work to do here. That's a great draw, though. <laughs> Nine ten jack. No game goes this hard. I've like, listen, this is irresponsible of a critic to do, but luckily I'm not a critic. I'm just a guy. No game has so obviously been game of the year, February of the year it came out than Ballot Show. I, I almost can't fathom a game coming out that would beat this for me. It scratches the itch so well. I played 30 hours of the demo, and then when the game came out, I was like, I wonder if I'm burned out on it. Nope! Nope! Lots of good stuff here. There's lots of good stuff here. Pal World? Come on. Dude said Pal World. Elden Ring? Nah, I mean, listen. If you're concerned about the legitimacy of your take, if you're worried about 14-year-olds online saying, how could Balatro be game of the year? It doesn't even have 3D models in it. Then sure, you got to do what you got to do to keep your job, okay? Like, Elden Ring, I had a great time with. I'm excited for Shadow of the Erd Tree. But when I finish playing Elden Ring, my first thought is, let's go eat some lunch. When I finish playing Balatro, I'm like, I got to knock out all this admin shit so I can play some Balatro tonight. Give me some chips. Give me, give me a, a monetary engine. And give me a random joker. Let's go hiker. Maybe we got a chip build. I like I like Chemomancer too, don't get me wrong. Retrigger all played face cards. Let's go next. Give me terror. Oh, we get to take two, bro. <laughs> That's so true. <clears throat> You know they always say, like, this ain't your granddad's roguelite? This actually is your granddad's roguelite. And that's why we love it. I'm gonna split the D. I'm gonna take uh, one steel and one purple seal, because a purple seal can generate many steels for us. Let's, I mean, red seal steel is unbelievably good. That's like the, the ideal card for us if we're gonna be using steel to add molt. Let's play five cards. We should add nines too. Did we, did we add a? No, we add more nines. That was not as good as I thought it would be. <laughs> how, did, how did that happen? Dump it, dump it, dump it. Did it chip me, chip me. We need 1,600. I guess it went hard enough, now that I think about it. 8, 9, 10. I think you hold 7, 8, 9, 10. It's going to be 28. It's going to be 78 times 2. It's actually going to be... 86 times 2. That's not good. <laughs> That's horrendous, man. But this is much worse. Hmm, okay. 
that, listen, there's a plan. The plan is not soaring. A pair with two steels, one of which is a red seal, and we're throwing the stone alongside it. A pair with a stone. It's going to get us there, bro. Easy. Also, our stones are getting re-stoned. Have you noticed that? Did you hear about this one? We need uh, jokers. Forget about that blank for now. We got to get econ pump in first. Molt me. Molt me. One in four chance to level up poker hands. Okay, can I get a joker that, that adds to our score, please? So we do be skipping blinds. This might be controversial. I kind of feel like we need misprint, man, for flat malt. Because, like, throwback is great, but, like, where's our... We don't have any malt yet. I think you go misprint instead of the... I got to trust my intuition on that one. I think I would rather play this one and then get two free spectral packs on the 4200, just in case. Okay, this is a lucky boy flush. Ahem. Ahem. It's a lucky boy flush incoming, dipped in Mama Liz's, etc. That was still really good. Three, four, five, six, seven. <clears throat> still really good. Her, etc. What do you mean? I mean, you know how it goes. You don't have to repeat the whole joke every single time. Start with Arcana. How about a Hermit? There is a Hermit. That's only eight bucks, though. You want to duplicate a stone? You know what? I'm going insano mode. Duplicate stones, bro. Your ass is not good enough for me. I got chips coming out of my whatever. Gross Michelle is malt, at least for the time being. Add an enhanced... You know what? I'm adding stones. If we get this... I mean, we're, we're literally fishing for like one joker in 10,000. But if we get this, the joker that scales on stones, it's over. I'm not destroying five cards in hand. It's too risky. Gold seal stone, bro. Gold seal stone. Rare Joker set money to zero. Destroy a random card, add two enhanced aces. Sorry, lad. Need it. Enjoy it. Sorry, lad. <laughs> oh, motherfucker. <laughs> I can't make that way. He's, he's got to go. He's got to go. Ah, what are we playing? What are we playing? What are we playing? It doesn't matter what we play. And it doesn't matter what your name is. You could be a stone. He didn't move at all, bro. So it's either a stone or a low diamond. Check this out. <laughs> Rock me, Amadeus. Then. Dump it, dump it, dump it. This could be a seven, but we'll never know. Ace and two stones. It's worth a try. It's still pretty good. Listen, boys, we have a seven of clubs left in this Andy. Yes, you gotta try, you gotta try. We have seven, eight, nine, ten, Jack, just hold. We have eight, nine, ten, Jack, queen. No. We made it work one time. That's what we call the luck of the draw. Oh, good. Create a copy of a random joke to destroy all others. It's like not playable. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not duplicating anything. It's just I. I'd, I'd be giving up my whole run to do so. You might be able to. Hear me out. If we're going to do it, we wait until we can voucher ourselves. We get our econ pumping first. And then, onk, 
on the marble joker just to create more stone cards. At some point, we're, it's, it's a roguelite, bro. At some point, we're going to do a pivot. Our pivot will be when we sell everything, duplicate our best joker, and then start rebuilding from zero. I'll select on this one. Our stones are not stoning yet. We're not quite there. I think this is like a pair build, man. How about two pairs with a little stone attached to it? Not exactly like, you know, blowing the doors off of the run right now, but it's not too bad. Worst discard of all time, asked to leave. I really, the problem is I don't want to play like one pair. <laughs> I've only got so many hands, you know? Very valuable though. Empress will molt me out of my gourd. Okay, now we're talking. You can really tell chatters who come from YouTube versus chatters who come from the librarian. Excuse me. <laughs> you know what? Maybe that's a better delineation than type A, type B. Do they watch youtube.com slash Northern Lion or the Library of Letourneau? It's crazy that the people who watch me directly are more condescending. <laughs> and the people who, who smoke the filtered version are like, I'm pogging, caught, caught, caught. The people who watch me are like, on turn 17, you didn't have the, you had the glass card fourth in the order instead of fifth. And I'm like, I know you're not wrong, but like, I'm, I'm just sick of hearing it. It's, that's not your fault necessarily. I don't know if we can afford the voucher. I think I might have screwed myself on that one, to be honest with you. Oh, Rare Joker sets money to zero, bro. Sorry. <laughs> no, really? What, do they got one Rare Joker in the game? Don't you read the YouTube comments? You ever hear the expression, um, you show me the incentives, I'll show you the outcomes? Probably take me two hours a day to scroll through all my YouTube comments, and the vast majority of them make me feel bad about myself. That doesn't seem like a good use of my time. Now, you're well within your rights to continue posting them, don't get me wrong, but like, you know, let's be real here. Honestly, dump them. Me personally, I don't think this is ideal. Listen, you don't, you don't do anything. I'm sorry, it has to be done. Clubs give you a benefit. Whatever. Wild Queen. Not, not my favorite payout. It is what it is. Death card. Now we're cooking. More stones, please. More eights. Okay. Seance, but it's pronounced like Beyonce. You speak on that for a minute? Kind of like what you're cooking up with that one. That was good, but not quite as good as I thought it would be. But this, who? Oh, good lord. 8, 9, 10, Jack Queen with an 8 at the front of the Andy? I guess it doesn't matter until we get a molt Molter, but still. That wasn't that good either. <laughs> we have one nine. Three sevens. Three fives, one three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. One of them is a club. So you're saying there's a chance. One four, two fives, two tens, two kings. <laughs> Wait a second. <laughs> so like that's pretty. That's a hundred and let's. I'm doing the numbers, okay? It's a hundred and fifty 
plus 8 plus 10. So 168 chips times 2. But it won't be 168 chips because these will all... It'll be 188 chips times 17 plus whatever this Andrew gives. Or... <laughs> it's... I no 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 we're not gonna that's just too much for me bro send it give it a chance who at some point we gotta like get the econ running it has not taken off so far can you can you bonus a stone lads can you bonus a stone? No? Scammed? We have taken threes out of our deck, right? We only got two threes. I, I, I guess clubs are clubs are meaningful. Sure. For now, we gotta build what we can. Gotta build what we're able. Shop has a rare joker. Oh no, I mean that's gonna be our double tag. The question is can we get to twenty two thousand points? And the answer is I oh, don't freaking know. Okay, hear me out. Dump your non-clubs. Now you got two pair with two steals and a freaking stone card burning a hole in your pocket. That was solid. If only we could rely on it long term. Yes, we do. We have a, almost have a flush. Should discard this card. And we have a flush. We would just prefer if it was with clubs, but or without using the steel card. So I just send it, bro. I'm sending it. There you go. Look at that. Get it twisted. 100% of gamblers quit before they hit it big. Okay, we needed Gross Michelle to hit the odds there. Two bucks in our pocket, huh? <laughs> Next round, skip blind. Now I'll just level with you. This is do or die. Love to see that. Love to see it. This is a stone, Andrew. Don't even lie to me. I know it to be true. We have to just hold the one stone. Play the flush. With the, with the eight chilling in your pocket. Lots of clubs on this one. We need big hands. I know you're the one. How about a big misprint too? Greater than 10 on misprint? 10 on misprint. Okay, it's, it's a start. It's a start. We need clubs. We have none discard. Oh, we're cooked. Okay, so this is, it's a problem. Uh, play your non-clubs and draw something freaking greasy on this. I think we're I think we're in trouble, lads. <laughs> Club, three stones. Actually, got us closer than I expected. So you could have played the stones and drawn more stones, but okay, we'll slash marker the first Balatro segment here. We go again. Straight flush would have won it. Yep. And if you knew the lottery numbers in advance, you just pick them. It's that easy. Okay, select me. In some ways, this is like the worst starting hand of all time. I guess we don't make rewards anyway. We might as well just play two pair. Holy cow. Do you think you are smarter than me? Be honest. I'm sorry. I don't mean this to be rude. I don't know who you are. I'm going to ride the bus for now. It's a little scary, but... I think I'm smart enough to not uh, get into a who's smarter competition with a stranger. Like, that, that seems like a great recipe for losing 
Because I don't know what you've got going on in your life. All I know really is you got great taste in, in streamers. That much is a given. Everything else, I don't know. Couldn't tell you. Currently plus one malt, huh? So this is like 20 points in my pocket right here. <laughs> we should only play because uh, we'll draw more face cards. 20 points in my pocket. Oh, 45 points in my pocket, more like. Okay, having a hard time committing to ride the bus early. Or were we just incrementing the molt as much as possible? Something to think about. Something to think about. So I think we should play. And then you could toss your freaking detritus thusly. Because it, it, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is how we, we farm discards, bro. When given the choice. Play 6-6, six, six, dump 8-10, and fish for the... Well, I guess you're not fishing for a straight, huh? We actually get here so easily, it's going to, like, make your head spin. What did I tell you? What did I tell you? We have some econ problems, though. <laughs> okay. This could save our life. <laughs> I don't know about that. Let's let's start cracking some packs. Let's see how it goes. Any chance you would like to economics me? Sensible plays. You got a card that converts things to hearts. Convert them to hearts. Destroy. Steve Harvey voice. Kill! Get rid of face cards. We got a long way to go until... That's going to do much for us. You would destroy two more face cards given the circumstances. I think it's the best option available. Okay, we have to. There's no, I mean, it was, it was a nope guaranteed. I did that so you had the choice to uh, put the emote out there. That's up to you. Now listen, listen boys, we do have five, six, seven, eight here. We play a pair of aces and dump the two and dump the king. We'll draw two more face cards to destroy later. You asked, you also have four, five, six, seven, eight. That's not my tempo, you should know that by now. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now that's it. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Nah, 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 nah. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yes. The next. We will not be skipping that one. And we have two, three, four, five. No ones, unfortunately. Get innocuous. Need a little destruction there, an appetite thereof. You're given 10 molts. 26 times 12. Me personally, 26 times 12 means this is better than a discard, even if it's uh, 26 times 13. We're making money already. Now, forget about the straight, okay? Dump this. There's full house potential. Now we're cooking. All you need is one joker. Sometimes all you need is one missing piece. Boys, you need to run hack long term. Even though seltzer might be better, if you're if you ever we're playing this game to fish for good stuff, okay? Spades are debuffed. Okay, play, match the cards. Match the cards on this one. We need to play something. How about a pair of aces that dumps a stinky four? Two fives remain. It's a really hard discard because you really want to discard face cards. 
I guess, I guess, I guess I would discard these. I'm willing to play 10, 10, 7, 6. Increments ride the bus and gives us a chance at a better hack hand. The better hack hand doesn't exist. I'm willing to play my fives, dumping a king, a queen, and an eight. Come on, come on. And then a full house. We're so back. <clears throat> now, all you need is a joker that... Or seals on your cards. Standard packs would go crazy. Lover's card we sleep on. Give me a good standard pack. I mean, golden four, at least I think it would re-trigger. <laughs> it's not great, honestly. We need something to use the double tags on, man. We're, we're in trouble. <laughs> okay, okay. Jack can't decide. Do they love the flush? Do they hate the flush? We don't know, but we're going to play the flush. That's for certain. Reasonable. We got our groove here. Two, three, four, five, six. I mean, it's... Still a good a good setup. How about oh there's no reward. We get two dollars. How about a joker that could change my life? Both of these jokers could change my life, but I'm sorry, I can't resist the tarot cards, bro. I can't resist them. It's too much fun to use tarot cards. Play 10-10 and dump your non-hack, non-flushes. Generate a tarot card. Tower. Gotta be honest with you, this looks like a, a straight up discard to me. I would dump the two even though it's hackable. Now, now we pivot a little bit, we're throwing seven, seven, stone me. 10-8, keeping the relative hack straight potential alive. Two, three, four, five, six. Am I crazy? Oh, it, it does not played. Okay, then a nine that's golden. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six. Hack isn't that good unless you have enhanced cards. Everybody, I just need you to chill out a little bit. It's anti-3. We've competed in four uh, battles so far. I know you're, you're blowing out your dopamine receptors on 17 quadrillion point runs. You just got to relax, okay? I know you're, you're talking just to talk. But you got to understand how it comes across as well. Discard me, discard me, discard me. Hold me just in case. That's a just in case me type moment. And then a, a four or a five that gets re-triggered again on a lucky card. Easiest play of my life. Popcorn to keep yourself alive. Necessary. Let me steal 10. And then dump, you never know, it could be a four. Dump your non hackable cards and keep the steal in hand. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's a stone! Let's go! Okay. Thought I was what? Dead? Like my partner you just threw off the cliff? Dump him. Dump him. Eh, keep him. Keep him. Dump him. If we ever uh, ruin Ride the Bus, though, our life is, is absolutely cooked. It's over. This is a great dump em opportunity. 
Suppose we don't know what you are. Let's play it. Okay, money's on sale, kind of. <laughs> Hermit? Fool. Hermit. The Econ exists. Emperor. Hanged Man is... Actually, both of these are pretty good. I was really hoping we would be able to destroy, but it is what it is. These are these are bad cards. Let's get a wild four. Makes flushes with hack more plausible. I I would like some multi cards. I should have bought this actually. Because a multi retriggering on the hack would have been nice. You know what? You're right. That is a good play. Celestial. Low quality hands. Two pair, good opportunity to grab some. We need we need a, a mult multer. Temperance gives us eleven dollars. That's nice. A mult multer would go crazy. Face cards give mult. Hilarious. Face cards give mult. Love to see that. Okay, how about sell value of all jokers gets added to the mult because popcorn's not going to last forever, and I have to spend my money down. Clubs give molts. I'm sorry. I gotta. I gotta spend my money down for the taros, but I'm not pleased with it. Now that would have been. <laughs> sell two, get temperance. Temperance gives up. But what are we gonna do with more money? We're just gonna have to spend it on rerolls. So yeah, yeah, yeah. So true. So true. Could get lots of planets, but I don't think the double tags are served well here. Now we're talking. A five that's lucky. no need for this yet. Five, five, four, four, and dump a 10. Imagine if we could double tag a negative joker, bro. God is my witness. I sell you. Hate to discard them, but they're not hackable. I'm, I'm going pot committed here. Dump them. I would, f I would go full house Andrew on this. <clears throat> we need something to replace popcorn, though. And we need to survive. So it's tough. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, 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 okay, create one planet card. Good one. Straight flush. Incoming. Buy, but don't use the fool, and we can thin our deck like crazy. I'm not skipping for hollows, bro. Bro? Bo? I'm not skipping for... I'm not drinking any freaking Merlot. That's the other thing. Dumping. Pretty bad. Pretty, pretty not good. Pretty good. We got we to do something with these freaking cards, but I only want to destroy tarot cards. Merlot is actually pretty good. I'm sorry, but you're basically asking me who would I trust more, you or Paul Giamatti? I got I to gotta go Giamatti on that, man. I got to go Giamatti on that. <laughs> it's not Paul Giamatti, it's Alexander Payne. Well, <laughs> in some ways, I suppose. Uh, in some ways. Didn't I, Elisa? Didn't I? Check this out. I kind of expected it to suck ass, but it did not. Nine dollars. Uh, it's, it's, this this is not the way. That's the thing about it is that it's just it's simply not the way. How about a buffoon pack? Okay. This plays nicely with hack. Not amazing, but it's something. 
I think we gotta let it fly. I'm not I'm not super optimistic, but I think we gotta let it fly. I have seven dollars. I'm not even generating tarot cards. Oh brother. <laughs> Three, four, five, six, seven. That is nice. Because we don't have to worry about making space for the tarot cards. It was good enough. Not good, but good enough. King, queen, get destroyed. Dump them. I was just going to say, we got pretty good like flush potential here. We got a sun card if we need it. Is it, how much is this? Well, it depends. We're holding a 7, so we had 14 to our mult. That's pretty good, man! No! <laughs> no! No, no, no! I guess it doesn't hurt really to turn them into hearts, but was three of a kind. Dumping this will add 18 to Malt. Nothing's gonna get re-triggered though. It's tough. I think these are not hackable, so let's just dump them. Let's dump the whole shebang. Just see what you get out of it. Dump these. And you got a possibly hackable hand at the end if you need it. I don't think we're gonna need it though. Two, two, four, five. Jack. Okay. We need help. We're not making it through anti five, I feel. That's not good. <laughs> that is not good enough. You need some reason to be running hack? Listen. One day. <laughs> one day, bro. These are gonna pop! No, you're not wrong, it is 10 molts. It is 10 molts. And it's got a high sell value. Okay, you know what? You swayed me. You swayed me on that one. They should add a roulette wheel to this. I'm not getting rid of hack, bro. It's, it's too, the, the pop off on it is too high. Well, I won't be re-rolling the boss blind four times or creating eight common jokers, so that's an issue. Sell Vagabond? Eh, that's actually pretty sensible. That's a sensible idea. Hang on. First, though, we're going to get uh, $80 out of our hack here. Two pair, Andrew. Tossing a nine. Why is hack so good? Retrigger effects tend to give you a high chance at a great score. They're not necessarily necessary for being anti eight, but if you want to get a 17 quintillion point hand, it's it's one of the classic sets up setups. Molts. Can you have lucky molts? No, because luck is an enhanced trait. But retrigger molt is good. Retrigger steel. Can you, if if you leave a steel three in hand, it doesn't get retriggered by hack. Okay, noted, noted. Check this out. My aces now get triggered by hack. Not that, like, it's hack is doing that much, but if we can start enhancing these cards, maybe, maybe there's something to it. Just let me live long enough to use the double tags, man. I'm begging you. I'm begging you. A stone card. I mean, this actually strikes me as like a pretty good full house. We can turn a face card into a stone card. Not that stones are like the be-all end-all for us. Please draw an enhanced Andrew. Thank you so much. We'll be turning our eight into an enhanced two. 
And now you're about to see the reason we've been so precious about hack, bro. A four of a kind with two re-triggered molt twos dipped in Mama Liz's eat your ass oil. That <laughs> wasn't that good. <laughs> okay, tower me. I'm not gonna lie to you, it's not nearly as good as I thought it would be. But that's just the start, bro. That's just the start. I can't believe we're running this deck. We've skipped zero blinds. <laughs> that would have, who would have fucking saved us, dude? How about a $6 buffoon pack? I mean, I guess having literally anything that gives chips would be kind of nice. <laughs> Please sell Vagabond? Bro, you don't get it, okay? You don't understand. It would... <sighs> Fuck it, fine. You're right. Okay, now, I, I don't necessarily think this is gonna pop, but it's something. At least I can hold some money now and build my econ. Okay, we can only play one hand type. Guess what? You're steel. We, don't, we definitely don't want to steal face cards. We want to cut all face cards. A little bit of clarity can help this. Do we wish to play two pair? Well, it is our only level two hand. <laughs> Dude, you play, it's simple. You play two pair. Tossing the 10. And if you get two lucky triggers, you're chilling. It's that simple. The 10 is a pair. Yeah, but if I play the steel card, they're going to send me to the chokey. Oh, good. Three, three, four, five, six, just so we needed. Now we got to do some math. Fives are no longer good. Fours are good. Threes are fine. Sixes can go. We Probably anything not hackable has to go. That's two pair. Two pair with no support whatsoever, but at least it plays <laughs> come on come on come on dump me dump me the way well threes how are we doing on threes one three zero fives that stings eights and nines go one three this is where i need like a combinatorics phd student what's more likely with 21 cards left in the deck Drawing two randoms or drawing one three. <laughs> Keep the nine. You, actually, you know what? I think you raise a good point. I think you raise a good point there. It's not your fault. Six, we throw sixes and eights. And you keep the stone because it could save your life. Well, at least, I, I can't be too mad. They at least gave us a chance. Now, this doesn't increment the square joker, but still, play a straight. This is where I get to say, you need to learn how to read. But you're right, it does feel good to wound other people. Let's just play only one hand type this round. Now, I'm just gonna level with you. Like, obviously this is nice, because just look at the art. But if this run's gonna pop, we 1,000% need the double tags to work like right now. I mean, like, listen. <laughs> you really scared. <laughs> the problem is, like, let's play it through, okay? You skip for a double tag and then maybe you skip this and your next eight jokers are rare. We're not gonna have the econ. We play this one, maybe get some money, skip this one. I don't know how, I don't know how in, on earth we're going to get to 40,000, man. Wait, what does the boss do? P. 
pillar. Okay, what does it do? All cards played this ante are debuffed. That's not great. Could be worse though. Surely one of the six rare jokers will be negative. I know, like this is where I put my money to... Nah, I'll just keep those. This is where I keep my money to buy them. If I had it! Flush house. <laughs> that would have been funny. <laughs> There we go. Hermit. See, Temperance is close to Hermit. I can't be mad. And then Spectral needs to save our life. Well, I'm not creating two copies of garbage. I think... I think I have to sell every Joker except for Ride the Bus. <laughs> Copy and hack. It's, I, gave, I gave it everything I could, man. That would at least give me a hundred malt and maybe I could get like a chip adder. I don't know, man. Like, I think it's, it's gotta be done. Like, it's, it's our only... if And people are not going to see it this way, but that's fine. If we make it to anti-10 on this run, we honestly have done an amazing thing. And then we go next round. Skip. And buy a rare joker that multiplies our mult. No, but then we don't beat the boss. We need we need something that adds malt. No, but this is we already have a hundred malt. I'm not buying this to get an extra twenty malt at best. Gains okay, this malts are malt. At the very least, for like two dollars, we can get a one hundred and fifty malt. And then for, I don't want to spend too much money, but for another $2, we can add another little bit to it. So that's, so everything is going to have 200 mult attached to it. So 200 mult getting to 40,000, we only need like a 200 point hand or a few 200 chip hands, I should say. There's something, okay, and then skip and we're going to have rare jokers like for the rest of our lives. We might as well throw out a discard here. We can never play face cards still. Don't lose don't lose sight of that. Okay, I'll I'll try it, okay? I know it's only level one, but just send it out there. That's clearly not good enough. Lesson learned. <laughs> How about a flush? They've done it. Come on. Grease me up. Grease me up a little bit. <laughs> After everything we've been through. No. I guess I did buy none planets. The whole time. I can't be too upset about that. Wait a second. We literally just won. It's that easy, boys. 17 rare jokers incoming. <clears throat> Listen, okay? <laughs> Obviously, you need blueprint. That's non-negotiable. 
And for now, you copy one of these. That does give you an extra 50 molt, which is crazy. We've removed kings from our deck. We literally have none. We're not going to make flushes. Are we playing twos? We do have seven twos in our deck. There's something to it, man. And you could copy it, but I, don't know. I think we're still copying that. I was hoping to get this in this, but it's just not going to happen. We still got two rare jokers incoming, and a double tag is going to give us $53. Actually, it's going to give us $106, and then... Okay, hear me out here. Two stone, jack. No, because then the two is not a high card. That wasn't even that bad. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Hold. <laughs> ace, ace, two, two, stone. It'd be nice to get some planets, bro. We just gotta sell some cards. Yes, yes! I do want to play this too, but it has to be scored. So it's not going to be scored, and that's fine. You play this. I'm not risking it with a too high card. That's too spicy for me. <laughs> now... We're, certainly, we're not going to be running Obelisk. This, it, it took until Anti-7, but it finally happened, okay? I don't think we can run the trio. I think we, we have our connection here. Now it's just like, it's buys and sells, bro. The problem is, how do we buy and sell? Because we don't have any joker space. Like, I don't want to get rid of this. I guess we could... <sighs> you got you to gotta sell one ride the bus. I'm not selling campfires the way we get there. No shot. Bro, you got to. Because all you need to do, ride the, having two ride the bus takes up two joker spaces. If we sell one and then we get the space to buy and sell two cards, then we have two ride the buses. It's that simple. I'm t we jokers got to go? That's my chips, bro. That's my only thing giving me chips. I'm sorry, it's got to go. You sell this. I, I Unless... It'd be nice. Let's open this first to see if we get a negative joker. I mean, li listen, there's some temptations here. I think it's a sell. Um, the, the hollow is irrelevant. Ten molt is not relevant. And I don't think the flushes are that relevant. So you select, sell, and then you take the family in case we get to play four of a kind. But we still might want to get more buys and sells going. It's tough. You could just sell it and buy the three of a kind. It's true. Let me let me cook up this standard pack for a second here. Mm, not good enough. More twos, please. Everything at the chips. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got it. We got something that molts our molt. I'm sorry, you gotta go. I wish you could freeze, man. Freaking freeze. You buy for three bucks, sell for a dollar. Buy for three bucks, sell for a dollar. Listen, we got so much money. Buy for six bucks. Sell. Buy here. We need negative jokers, man. Negative jokers would hit the spot. Useless. I'll roll once more. Beautiful. Now you might say buy and sell this tarot card. Nah, bro. <laughs> Just for that, you get one more. You buy Pluto, you don't sell it yet. You sell it if it looks like you need it. Now, three of a kind twos would go crazy. Six, eight, nine, not that valuable. Dump them. I'll be honest with you, I'm a simple kind of man on this one. 
I think you just play your flush. And you know what? While we're here, why not? Not every single run needs to, or not every single hand needs to be three of a kind or a full house. It's nice that you make extra space, but it's not what we need. Now, the problem is, again, we need tarot cards and planets. So, Earth is three of a kind, Venus is three of a kind. Venus is going to be easier to hit. Go Voucher. The problem is that'll give us Mercuries like crazy. So we got to play against it. Earth is full house. Now... I like your chips, bro. How about a negative Joker? Saturn is a good buy-sell. Emperor is a great buy-and-use. Into a sell-sell. I'm trying to keep all my jokers for now. <laughs> You're what? Times 2.5? It's only anti-8. I think we can chill a little bit. Next base edition joker becomes polychrome. I think we got to give it a chance, at least. We got to give it a chance. Now, we love to play three of a kinds. We love to play twos. We love to play full houses. Two sixes, two sevens, five twos. Three fives. If we don't play three of a kind, we're probably going to be fine. But I'm, I'm keeping my freaking options open. And, dude, I don't know, man. Here's the thing, okay? I didn't make the Joker rarities. Local Thunk made the Joker rarities, okay? So the fact that we Joker is a rare makes me feel like we should be keeping this dude. Polychrome popcorn. What a sick fucking joke. <laughs> makes me want to throw up. Okay, Emperor goes crazy. Because we can at least get two cells out of it when we need it. There's nothing here, man. There's nothing here. How about an enhanced two? I gotta snooze that, unfortunately. We go next. We don't need to spend. Okay, one card is always selected. We simply must play our hand here. We up all night to get lucky. It sucks that it's only two pair, but so be it. So be it. Juice me. If you start smoking, you're guaranteed to get a billion point hand in this game. Listen, I don't want to be that guy. Who's going to tell him? <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. All right, so that took out like a hundred molt. <laughs> yeah, you're right, you're gone. <laughs> okay. It's still, with two hands, it's still so makeable. Playing a steel card and destroying a steel card are like the same thing. So if we are discarding, so if we want to discard, you can discard. But what would we be discarding? We'd be discarding to try to get three of a kind. There's two fours left. There's a nine left. There's only one ten left. How many fives? We got three fives left. I'm discarding. I'm, there's no benefit in playing a steel card. Send it. Send it. You've done me a great disservice here. I own you, little bro. Now. Move blueprint? Brother, it's this... This is where it has to be, man. I'm not multiplying, you know, 
two pair by by three by three, we got to add some fucking chips into the ecosystem. got to add some fucking chips. We got to add a hundred chips. I think we're cooked either way. So there's one way out. <laughs> you ready for this shit, bro? One in five chance for 20 molts. 20 molt times nine with 74 chips on it. That stings. Same thing. Come on, man. Yes! Okay. <laughs> and now we got so much space for activities, bro. Plus one hand size. Huge. Now we lock in. Aura. Talisman. Okay, Aura is the only thing that's going to save us. Polychrome on a two. Can I add polychrome to my, um, to my cool two? Yes. Thank you, gamers. That was foil. What a, what a sack of crap. Foil banana. I snooze you any day of the week on that one. Welcome to the party. You have been kicked out of the party. Okay, it's important. Now, if I can get this to pop on twos, there's something to be said. You're giving 2.5, okay. Skip for mega buffoon pack. Lads, it's gotta be done. I'm sorry to Seltzer. It's the way of the world, bro. And you're just not sticking around. <laughs> It's way, way, way too late for uh, any of this. But especially Burnt Joker. Um, we can at least run this for 10 seconds. Hmm. Delightful. Hmm. Transcendent. It's quite simple, really. I can play face cards again, but I don't want to because my straight here would contain two steel cards, but so be it. Let's keep the steel card in hand. This is going to be good. And I guess, like, might as well send you over there for now. I don't know if that was actually like any good, but a jester. <laughs> I mean, it says the lad's compatible. I just gotta, I gotta trust the process. Okay, that one was just me trolling. <laughs> Boys. Come on, really? We don't get anything out of it? She freaking seltzered me again. Can you believe it? Dare roll. We may play four of a kinds at some point. It's kind of like a little cope, but so be it. It's like. To buy and use in this house. Car retrigger all face cards. Hilarious. Hilarious. This entire run has been cope. It sounds like you're the one coping, brother. We fucking won. I'm sorry. I don't think we're playing many flush houses. These are both cells in my house. Now you're you're not really an uncommon. We actually have none on commons. This is not a not a great opportunity for the baseball card, unfortunately. Playing a pair sets your money to zero. Okay, okay, I see you. We will not be playing a pair. <laughs> we'll be... 
How do I, where, where does the blueprint go, man, in order to juice the Wee Joker? Does it go on Seltzer or does it go on Wee Joker? I mean, look at this Juicy Lucy. Put it on Campfire? No, bro! Are you kidding me? I want my Wee Joker to pop! Obviously, it's going to give us more score on Campfire, but look at this. Again, 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 yeah, 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 This dude better be giving me a thousand chips. 178 chips? Are you kidding me? That's actually pretty good. Oh, that's what I meant when I said, are you kidding me? Sorry. <laughs> Jumbo me? Yeah, we won't be doing that. It's a little late for that. It's a little late. A little. You know what? I don't see any damn twos in my hand. Get bent, brother. That's an insane draw. Yeah, I guess we'll be adding gold seal to a molted two. How does that strike you? Yeah. <laughs> I should have bought this for all it doesn't last. Well, not that big of a deal. Bro, you straight chilling? Times two molt? You're not really, I gotta be honest with you, you're not, not really straight chilling. Shut the front door. We compete on these. Jack becomes a multed two. All of a sudden, be careful who you make fun of in high school. <laughs> Me doing four digit numbers multiplied by five digit numbers. Okay, well, no more fucking around. Apparently you have to be here. Dude, this guy is popping, though! He got like an extra 100 chips off of that. Got an extra 100 chips off of that. Fuck. Oh my god. Guys, I'm, I'm sorry, it has to be done. It absolutely 1000% has to. You gotta feed him. You gotta feed the Wee Joker. Those gains are permanent. Probably. A million points. No big deal. How you doing? Seltzer's still chilling. This this dude, we tripled it. We tripled his efficacy. We tripled it. I honestly feel like this is a buy and use. This is a buy and sell. I don't even want the standard packs. Now, duo is tempting, but we can get the efficacy of duo so much better. We need, no, 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 you don't take it yet. You don't take it yet. You know why you don't take it yet? You have to keep Wee Joker, he's popping, and Seltzer is, is sending this dude to the moon. So you don't create a Joker space just to create a Joker space. When, when this is gone, when Seltzer's gone, we'll talk, okay? But for now, you gotta juice this Joker. This is a hold. There's a two in the red pack. Okay, I'm trusting you. That's not your fault, okay? As, I, as, as tempting as it is, we gotta keep the deck thin. You probably meant the blue, the blue pack. Maybe you're colorblind. Okay, ban this person from the chat. I'm just joking. We're just chilling. Okay, I would actually maybe molt some twos. I'd molt some twos. And I mean, right, right out the the damn gates here. We got two lucky cards played in a in a in a full house with three of a kind. <laughs> come on, come on, come on! I want to see it. Oh, tw twenty molt and twenty dollars, and then it got twenty molt again, bro. That one lucky card added twenty bucks and forty molt. Holy! Just draw a two, little bro. It's literally not hard. It's the easiest card in the deck to draw. You gotta play twos. It's that simple.
little man's giving us 500 chips now. First, maybe you get a hermit card. Temperance is great, don't get me wrong, but this is two tarot cards. If they both suck ass, which they do, it's the easiest sell of my life. Level up four of a kind. Honestly, nuts on the table, we skip these. Flush house, I'll buy and use it. We actually have been playing it a little bit. Based. <laughs> Why? Because it's funny. Uh, 16 bucks. Take a buy and use on that. Are you crazy? I'm swagged out of my fucking gourd right now. How many? We got five seltzers left? That's not even that bad, man. You send it, obviously. I don't care if it hits seltzer. I'd be I'd be pleased to give it some credit. That's all right. That's, that's a nope waiting to happen. Both of these cards actually game relevant. Okay, we can only play one hand. This means there's no fucking around. I'm sorry to do this to you, seltzer, but on this one, there's no fucking around. <clears throat> Everybody chill. It's very easy for us to create a full house. We just want it to be a full house that has twos involved somewhere. Thank you so much. So we take an eight and we turn it into a lucky two, I suppose. And then we turn this seven into a steel card. I'm so tempted. Like, I know we're going to hit it, but I just... I I just can't throw the whole run away for that. We got the 20 bucks again, huh? And the molt, and the molt. There we go. All right. Good stuff. We do want tarot cards to appear more frequently. This one is popping, bro. Anti-11, and it's got scaling potential. We want more tarot cards so we can sell more easily. The problem is we might need the Joker space to sell. But first off, this one has a two in it. Oh, you're you're tempting me. Two lucky card for you too. That's pretty good. Tarot's please. That's a tarot, but I can't sell it. You're losing me, my jury. This dude is out times 1.5 right now. This is a must buy and sell. Most expensive reroll in human history. Sell seltzer. You don't agree with my vision, and that's fine, but you will one day. <laughs> I hope. I don't want my mega buffoon pack yet. So we need what, seven million? Seven million is doable. Not, not even a challenge. I'd actually rather you become a better two. I am gonna discard you though, because any other card becoming a two would probably be even better than that. I guess we keep two sixes to, no, 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 because you just, three twos gets you there. Are you a, I mean, you're kind of a better two. Maybe we're getting a little too picky. It would be nice if it hit like a lucky, but. Um, <laughs> I have no idea what to turn into a two, man. I guess this four. Fine, fine. I'll do it. I'm not, I'm not, listen, you got to strike a balance between, ah, we got to keep, I, I, just in case. We're, we're getting to the point, you can't mess around. How many you got on you? Three hands. I'm glad we had the Joker where we, where we had the Joker. It is. It's a little hot. It is a little hot. Five hundred sixty-two chips times three times three. Okay. I mean, this is times seven.
give it a try at least. Fuck am I supposed to do with this? PC load letter? The fuck does that mean? Three of a kind with two stones? I know we lose a steel in the process, but it's the cost of doing business. Never mind, that was horrible. <laughs> that was absolutely horrendous. <laughs> but then this three of a kind wins it for us. There's no doubt about it. And Seltzer will break at the perfect time! At the perfect time. <laughs> Okay, now... Give me some Mega Arcanas. These are important moments for society. Honestly, is this, this is like our best two. So I, I feel like that's not the card I'm looking for. We could turn an Ace into a two, but I feel like we got enough good twos. I honestly feel like at some point, well, you could turn it into a two and then glass it. <laughs> but I also feel I'm sorry to do it. I am sorry to do it. This is the way. We need the capital for buy sells. And we're in a rough spot. Hello, Chibli. Hello. Just do whatever you want. Just do whatever. You never do read chat when you open packs in this game. What is Chibli's lost his mind, bro. Are you okay? Does anyone know what Chibli's saying? Hang on. Money's on sale. You had a stroke? I said it wrong the first time. Then I read it more carefully and I, I understood it even less. Listen, listen, boys. It's 47 malt times six times three times 1.5. I think you can afford to run this against the next blind at least. Is it true, by the way? Listen, I know people, um, they accuse me of being a boomer. I'm actually like, one of the least uh, boomer people my age on the planet. It's true. You can you can hate me if you want for saying the truth, but it's true. I've been reading all the like uh, kind of ancillarily to the like r slash teachers like complaining that kids are like five years behind on their reading level, which which may well be true. I literally don't know. I'm not a teacher. I just entertain their kids after they get out of class. <laughs> I've seen posts on Reddit, so who knows? But they're from like, I'm a, I'm a HR manager who has been hiring the first Gen Z people that have made it into the workforce. And oh boy. So none of them know how search engines work. They just type one word into Google and then scroll until they get what they want. They don't know how to use the command line. They don't know like how to find a file in a directory, et cetera, et cetera. Some people were saying they don't know how to type. Uh, they, they type with one finger and then they never use like punctuation mark even in their corporate emails. I think I'm, I'm putting nuts on the table. That's anti-Gen Z bias made up by someone online who wants to erode the social contract of the world. I don't believe that that's true. I believe that somebody has made that up and because it at first it appears to confirm your biases and come from a place of authority, you go, yeah, that seems like it could be true, but I don't believe that it is true or at least not true enough to be representative of the whole generation. And that's not just because one day I'm going to have to rely on Gen Z for income, okay? And possibly to take care of me in a nursing home at some point. <laughs> but it doesn't hurt, okay? It doesn't hurt. We need to buy and sell jokers. No, no, no. We just, we just creamed it, bro. We can actually save money as crazy as it is. The oldest Gen Alpha is like 10. That's, I, I mean, I, I know, or I agree with you. I, I agree with the facts, I suppose. 
but it uh that's why i stand up for generation alpha whenever people are talking smack about them on online i'm like you're literally talking smack about like the oldest gen alphas in the fourth grade right now bro like cut them some slack they literally can't fight back just play this don't be silly just play that send it that was beautiful we do need three of a kind though one six remains honestly you toast well no 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 why not discard one card draw three yeah he's figured it out finally oh man Every TikTok comment is like, why are kids these days so cooked? I know, and I, I can't say it because, again, I rely on being in the good graces of public opinion in order to, like, continue to make my income. But, the, like, people are like, oh, the kids' attention spans are cooked these days because they're watching, like, Mitch, Miss Rachel on YouTube. And I'm like, have you ever seen what the average adult watches on YouTube and TikTok? It's fucking, like, a, a fake lawyer saying, like, don't pay your taxes. They legally can't put you in prison and stuff like that. A lady digging up, like, a whole mine shaft under her house and stuff like that. Like, the, the kids are, they're watching mostly, like, educational content. Now, maybe some kids have too much screen time, but, like, why don't you look at your media diet, bro? You're watching, like, insane conspiracy theories and stuff like that. Just mindless, not everybody, but... A lot of mindless drivel out there, like Northern Lion Plays Balatro, episode 91. I love having a flat malt. Well, listen, you gotta buy this, obviously. I love having a flat malt. I love having steel cards. But something has to go to make space. It's just the way of the world, brother. How about instead of... Oh, but that's polychrome. That's right. Yeah. Okay. That's a good, that's a good point. Flush house me. <sighs> we Joker has to go. This guy's not going anywhere, brother. One thing's for certain. Campfire cannot go. And Blueprint cannot go. Because it's necessarily our second best Joker. Trio, you need something very serious to get rid of it. It only leaves Fortune Teller, bro. It only leaves Fortune Teller. I, I wish it weren't so, but it is. The problem is, what's our flat molt on a three of a kind? 11. Times three, times three. What's... I was going to say, what's three times three? <laughs> I think we can run this for now. And let's... Uh, I need 300 million points. I think we're cooked, guys. <laughs> ah, it's tough. I could skip and then try 600 million. Librarian, thanks for the gifted subscriptions. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Why wouldn't you roll more? I honestly always forget that anti-12 is 300 million. Why didn't you tell me? Instead, you were just plus twoing me for my take about Gen Z being okay. Well, listen. Imagine... I'm sorry, you obviously have to be sold. Um, let's start small. It's not my favorite two, I'll admit, but... So I'd love to see about 150 million off this one. We're a little short. How does four of a kind look? 25... Okay, we have to play four of a kind. Sorry, fives. We have to play, and we have to get the lucky. <laughs> we <laughs> imagine, bro. Imagine your flat molt was doing work. Oh, that's five. No, it's not. Listen, 
we weren't getting there either way, but you are right. When you're right, you're right. And that time, you were definitely right. I need four twos, please. Just play this. Give me four twos. The flat mold was doing work, but the, the flat mold by itself was not getting us to, to 600 milli. Still a great run, though. Anti-12. It's probably like my third best run of all time. Okay, slash marker me. We'll call that Balatro 2. We go again, obviously. Blue steak? Orange steak? Do I even have... Where do I have blue steak unlocked, man? Checkered deck, blue steak. Shops can have eternal... That's oh, black steak. Blue steak. Minus one discard. You think so? You think so? I mean, this we didn't run flushes too much last time. Base, small blind gives no money. Score scales faster. Eternal Jokers minus one discard. Send it. I could skip. I bet I could afford a foil Joker. Holy bursh. Uh, run spades. Run spades. What are Eternal Jokers? It's the classic double-edged sword. An Eternal Joker, after obtaining it, it cannot be sold, which is obviously bad, but it also can't be destroyed. So I feel like the catch is... Um, are we really going to try to run a straight build just because our first Eternal Joker is foil and gets scaled off of it? Oh. <laughs> Whatever, we're so early in the game. It'll be fun. It'll be fun. Give it a chance. And 50 chips, we got a pair. Let's just give it a shot. Straight flush build incoming. Imagine, though. Okay, four, six, seven. Hey, what was I saying? Okay, I think the, the catch... Four, six, seven, boys. Three, four, six, seven. Um, Three, 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 four, seven, six, uh, fucking, okay. I forgot what I was talking about. I've made a mistake, but we're still going to get there. We're not playing, we're not playing good ball right now. I think that having an eternal Joker might be kind of sick when you get those, um, hex cards or the, the cards from spectral packs that destroy a Joker. It would mean that like a Joker that was eternal couldn't be destroyed, which could be nice. Plus 150 chips if you got a four of a kind. I gotta be honest with you, I don't I don't think we can really run that. <laughs> and I also can't get rid of this one, so we'll probably not buy it. But Wrathful Joker could kind of go insane, right? And we make no money, but if we get the chance to play straights, that would be huge. So let's keep four, five, seven, eight. Four, five, six, seven, eight. We gotta take this opportunity to scale Andrew. We're just making plans for Andrew. You can call me crazy for this one. I literally don't think we need popcorn. Discard a flush. That's how, that's how serious I am. I'm not playing any fucking games here. Three, four, five, six, seven, straight flush. 6,000 points, little man. Me at the movie theater lately? I just gotta be serious with you. If I'm at the movie theater, I'm getting popcorn. It's happening. You already know how it is. Decreased level of poker hands. Not even concerned about it. Because everything's level one. Now, the, you're gonna say, well, NL, when was the last time you were at the movie theater? Five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's not really a good answer for you, but uh, I don't remember. It might have been when I saw The Batman. That seems to me like it could have been the last movie I saw in theaters, and I'm pretty sure that the sequel's coming out in like a year. Smeared Joker, basically useless. Okay, hang on. Arcana pack? Great. Uh, this, is what, this is what we're here for, bro. It's the Hermit.
Hmm. I don't even. I, I think you just want a steel card. And eventually, we may want our whole deck to be spades. So you know what? We put it on this. Now, I'm not going to go over the rigmarole once more. Why add it to a spade if you want to play spades? At some point in my head, I'm removing every single heart from the deck. Now, that may not be realistic. <laughs> All spade cards are debuffed! But that's the way, that's the way I'm looking at it, at least. Listen, I think you gotta get Chip Andrew popping off, man. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, bro. It's every day, bro. If he's gonna be here eternally, you have to, you have to put some respect on his name. Uh, funny joke. How about a wild five? A smart viewer once told me every straight must have a five or a ten in it. Pretty clever, right? Now, it's a, good, it's a good six, don't get me wrong. You keep forgetting about ace, one, two, three, four. <laughs> I like that. You, you absolutely have to take polychrome every time it shows up. It's that simple. All spades are debuffed. Okay, now, we got to think about our score. Heart flushes are fine. Obviously, a heart straight flush would be better, but... Let's start here. This has a pair in it as well. That's not even close to good enough. It has to be a heart straight flush. We have none discards remaining. That's an issue. Hold. Gains 10 chips, but 10 chips. Let me let me think about this for a second. This will be 80 chips times 4. So 110 chips times 4. That doesn't get us there. You've already played the 6 of hearts. Ah, Yoda voice. There is another. It has to be straight flush. I don't even know if a straight flush of hearts would actually get us there. We, we might be We might be completely cooked. And only a six matters. Yeah, only we need to draw the other six. Okay, we're definitely cooked. I mean, that's why they call it stake five, you know? You needed the molt from the spades? There is a problem with that. Win in one, please. <clears throat> There was one problem with that one. Six dollars, little man. Put that stuff in my hand. Plus 20 mult if your hand contains four of a kind. Listen, listen. <laughs> you think? <laughs> Just hold. For now, we got 8, 9, 10, Jack. 7, 8, 9, 10, Jack is a great hand. Mama listens chili oil. Little ice cream goes a long way. Discards two random cards per hand played. Okay, okay. We do have a flush. We also have great uh, royal flush chances here. It's that easy. Two discards is tough to deal with. Nah. No sweat, man. Don't even worry about it. We will not be running Riff Raff. We will be running, for $2, we will be running plus four mult, though it pains me to do so. And then tossing out an Emperor card and praying for mercy. And then, you know what? Then saving our money so that we can Hermit effectively next time. Cards drawn face down. No, no, no. We ain't skipping this one. Convert three cards to spades. Straight flush. Three, four, five, six, seven. The one time I want the spectral candle, bro. I'm 
going hermit first. It's only 10 bucks, but still. Fool me. We're cooking now. One in two chance to create a tarot card when a booster pack is ripped. Send me, bro. Hang on, we're doing something here. Lovers me. Emperor me. Empress me. And magician me. Librarian, don't do that to yourself, okay? Don't say, look at that queen. I saw your tweets. The algorithm has sussed me out, and it sussed me out properly. It said, you tend to like tweets by this person. I said, that's damn true. But now I, the problem with that is that now I see your tweets. <laughs> and <laughs> Not all of your tweets are funny clips of me. Some of your tweets are, belong to a very different genre. Not take not takeable because if it hits ice cream, I cry. Steel, always good. Hanged man, nuts on the table, move to cut more hearts from the deck. Devil, not good enough. Strength, unnecessary. Let's get things going and then we'll worry about steel later. And then rip a pack because it gives us a good chance to get a card. Oh, thank you so much. And then... Um, this is fine. We'll take a six. We want it, we're okay with discarding it anyway, but we'll, we'll wild it later or something. So after the first hand, your shit's drawn face down. I'm not even going to cry about that. I'm the type of guy that doesn't even bother me a bit. What did I tell you? Tempting. Tempt, you know what? I think you could do a lot worse than an eternal fortune teller. High Priestess gives you two planets. I think any opportunity to add like a spade works well for us. Do we care about blue seals? I guess I, I habitually underrate planets. I co sign the librarian tweet. He's spitting. So the wild cards in Balatro horn you up, is what you're saying. Like, I'm not, it's not me saying that. That's what you're saying. Because the wild cards, and this is not me saying it. This is a quote from you. The wild cards <clears throat> remind me of running mascara. Can we just step through this? Like, I, I think that's insanity. They silenced Jesus, too. That's huge, like, crypto bro energy. They made fun of Thomas Edison for inventing the toilet, too. And now, we shit in one every day, bro. We're so early. Now, abstract joker kind of pops. <clears throat> Me, personally, I do like creating cards. It has been nice, though, to have chips from ice cream. I think this is a skip, though it, though it pains me. I think it is a skip. Now you must steal something. R slash anti-work Redditors when they're in a locally owned hardware store be like, I must steal something. So I'm just, it's a, literally a joke, okay? It's literally a joke and you're the one getting mad about it. Okay, I will create another steal card. You can be steal wild, right? Nope. No, you can't. You can be, though. We want to wild up. Now, this, you have to use one. We want to wild up a club. But at the end of the day, wilding a heart, even though it is a steel card. I literally... Okay. <clears throat> We're back. Ha, 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 ha. 
<laughs> We're so bad. Hit the control Z on that one. Sorry, sorry. No, can't can't do it. Not gonna do it. Take a jumbo arcana. Nothing happens. Nothing ever happens. Aren't you following the memes? Emperor me. Temperance me. Lover's card goes huge. Hmm. Next. All hearts are debuffed. Which means wild cards are horrendous for us right now. So you don't have to burn it too early. I think we're straight chilling still. We need telescope because this is like so obviously flush coated. I want to see stand up of you, but instead of standing up, it would be sitting down and in a room with two way glass. I guess you said one way glass. Now that I think about it, most glass is two way glass, huh? Are you calling me? You want me to be arrested for speaking the truth? Hannibal Lecter style. How funny is it that they... I, like, I think it's genius, just to be clear, that they did this. But how funny is it that they had Hannibal Lecter strapped to a fucking hand truck, but then they also had that, like, leather mask. Like, the dude has such an insatiable hunger for human flesh that they were like, just having him strapped to the cart is not enough. Even with him being completely immobilized, some human flesh might find a way into his mouth. That's how you know that motherfucker was not kidding around. We can get away with this. We only play one hand most of the time. So, listen, listen, boys, listen. At some point, we're going to want your ass to be wild. I'm sorry to say it. It's simply the honest-to-goodness truth. And then I'm still going to discard you. Because the tarot card is worth more. And then we hermit. And then we fool. And then we hermit. And all of a sudden, you'll be ashamed of your words and your deeds when I play a nearly royal flush. This is a, this is a, the Earl of Flushes. Retrigger all face cards. This is a very valuable card. It's a very, very valuable card. We could start enhancing our face cards. But let's just relax for a second. Let's buy a Celestial first. Tower. I will use it, but I'm not pleased about it. Earls are still royals, my guy. I don't know. I've never seen a show that Jason Lee has been in personally. <laughs> Please stop doing Hannibal Lecter if he was uh, the duet boomer on TikTok. Human living, it's, it's so good. Human liver dipped in Mama Liz's chili oil. <laughs> Bisexual Hannibal Lecter. Excuse me, you haven't seen the TV show. Invisible Joker is insanely valuable. Imagine if it copied Sock and Bussin. Librarian when he sees a wild card. Listen, I, I hate to get rid of the ice cream. It has done great work for us, but I think this is like a, a, a late game combo that could really pop. It might kill us in the midterm, but... I was going to make a joke about politics, but it wasn't really going to stick, to be honest. Face cards get triggered twice. Okay, let's let's see how this looks at least. Let's see what we're cooking with here. That's t it's completely a okay. Right, guys. Right. Yeah. And then some tarot cards would go crazy. Like, how about a free tarot card? Oh, you shouldn't have. <laughs> we are making... F okay, that's, that's a very helpful mult. We only got to beat three blinds, bro. It's not like those jokers would help us. Cards previously played are debuffed. 
But we get a free tarot card? Okay, well, we'll be dumping our debuff cards. That's sadly a given. Boys, <laughs> this is the way it is. Okay, and you know what? They won't even let me use it. At least we have a steel card and we upgraded flush. So this is like half decent, hopefully. Could use a little more juice on that. Discard me. How many, how many spades versus hearts? Roughly an equivalent amount. But face cards trigger twice. It's a spooky time. Yes, 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 yes. Fine, I'll do it. Little bit of luck would have gone a long way on this one. But here, give me a couple hearts, bro. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 please. Please. We hold. Now. <laughs> Chip me, please. Can I find a way to get some chips? Listen, we need score to survive so that later we can sell Invisible Joker. I know what I must do, okay? What you do is... First, you rip your packs. But you start with this one. Free tarot card. The man's a fucking genius. Use it. Thanks for the free money. Now, do we like any of these cards? I'm not adding a base level six, and I'm not adding anything unsuited. So, get out of my head, Charles. And then rip this, another tarot card. What a send-off. What a send-off. Now, none of these are what we need. So for now, it's a skip, but we're gonna sell you and get a better Joker. Okay, this is basically a reroll. Plus one discard, it's not good enough. I, I'm not going to be too picky. Admittedly, fuck chips. Times two malt is going to be good enough. Sell me. Oh, but he's, a, he's an eternal Andrew. You're going to give times one malt. You may have some long-term potential, but no, no, no. I'm rolling once more. Hearts give plus four mult. It must be done for now. Okay, this is just for survival. I have a plan, okay? Relax, I'll handle it. We will not be skipping because we need to do this so that we can get Invisible Joker to pop. I guess we could have used our judgment too. It's a good point. But we're going to sell this slad as well, don't worry. Hi, Tomo. What happened to deleting every hard card? You guys got to think more than six inches in front of your face, okay? Invisible Joker's about to pop. We sell and sell, and then it's forced to copy either Fortune Teller or Sock and Buskin. Either one of which gives us endless potential. If we die in the interim period, we die in the interim period. That's life in the six, man. Making mistakes out here is bad for your health. Okay, now, obviously a heart's flush would go insane with Mama Liz's chili oil. Huge. I'm just gonna level with you. It's too late for DNA. If you get it early, it might be the best Joker in the game. And it's very fun, but it's not the right time now. So, you're gone. If you, because I don't wanna copy 15 mult. If you copy four, 28 mult, I'll live. You're gone, you're gone. Structure my whole run. Oh, but no, 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 no. Okay, I got, no, no, I got it. Sell me, give me this guy. Give me this guy, then give me DNA and we'll copy face cards. 
by me will be copying face cards and then we need to enhance our face cards via the Jumbo Arcanas. Every played Queen of Hearts gives times two multi-win score. We'll hold for now. Pop the Jumbo Arcana. If we can't make our hand better, we need to make face cards better. So give us a judgment. Okay, double my money. Jumbo Celestial. For now, we're flushing. Boys go to Jupiter to act more stupider. I've heard that. High Priestess, that's a buy and use. Jupiter, thanks so much. We will never play a pair. Sell it. We go next. I think we play because we want to use DNA. The problem is we only have four hands, so you got to be careful. Right now, Wild Queens. Holy cow. And then... Because that... Okay. So face cards trigger twice. That's good because we have like low chips. Do we want to play... No, no, no. I think that would be stupid. Wouldn't you be better off playing this? A level 5 flush? I guess you'd rather put another face card. Although this could help us make a flush with these. Give, that's only four cards. <laughs> with Mama Liz's chili oil? That was not good enough. Steel card. Things you love to see. Things you love to see. A full house with a steel card in hand. And the Queen of Hearts that gives times two molt when scored. And I had the foresight to accidentally put it at the end, which is where it belongs. God, some negative jokers could hit the spot. Because I literally have... I basically have five jokers. There are four jokers that don't add score. Sheesh! It's an interesting one. Um... I feel like molting a queen of hearts goes crazy. I understand it will not be wild anymore. But then the queen getting triggered like four times? It means just playing that queen is like... Uh, yeah, maybe it's a little too clever. You might be right. You might be right. We could just, we could always just do... Always just do that. Not that big of a deal. Save some money. ING direct. Play only one hand type this round. Should be doable. Unfortunately, you're not the ideal queen for us, but more face cards is very important. Eight, nine, ten, jack, queen. It's the 20th time I've done that on DNA. <laughs> what do you think, guys? Do you like our odds on this one? It's going to be tough. <laughs> oh, that stings. That one stings. Let's call that Balatro 3. It happens. It happens. Playing too fast. Should have exited and rebooted. Loser behavior. No disrespect. You're going to take L's in life. Shouldn't be afraid to take them in a safe environment. You see all those posts about... Uh, people are starting to catch on to something that I've been saying for years. <clears throat> Endless optimization, especially of games, has led to decreased happiness for people who pursue gaming as a hobby. It's really... It feels like it's coming to a front in Helldivers 2. Because on one side, you have people that are like, I'm having fun with this game, running whatever loadout I want. And then you have hardcore Andrews, who are like, if you're not running a grenade launcher and then the other three best stratagems, we're going to kick you off of the squad. It's crazy, man. I did see people in the tweets under it, though. Someone said, this is why I stopped playing chess when I learned it was just a memory lesson for two smart people playing against each other. And I'm like, you don't know what you're talking about. You, unfortunately, you got to... 
703 ELO and you said this is just a memory test and you're not you're not right once you get into the mid game it's creative thinking and problem solving and long-term planning and it's all novel okay but yeah if you're just constantly running into Englund's gambit then I could see how that would be annoying I like to I'm fun maxing man that's the way I'm choosing to live my life I'm fun maxing don't discard Tempting to get a straight flush, we're gonna get there anyway. Like in Balatro, losing that last run was frustrating for like two seconds, but then it was funny because I can remember it forever. Or until tomorrow at least. Okay, I mean, a free Hermit is kind of sick. <laughs> I feel like Polychrome Banner is like amazing and then horrible. Just give me a second here. Maybe we get another Hermit. Just run no discards. Okay, dude, but that's like really hard. <laughs> that's really tough. I think I think you take it because it's shiny. And you know, that's that's about the extent of my wisdom on that. Okay. Rip a standard pack first. No, thank you. It's one of the worst I've ever seen. Get delayed gratification. Yeah, but like, have you learned nothing from roguelites? This is like Isaac 2015 over and over again. People are like, Eve's Mascara is great. Just get number one. And you're like, brother, I, like that's out of my hands. I don't have control over that. Reroll start at zero. No, 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 not necessary. Stop talking about mascara. Sorry. 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 I mean, times 1.5 is good. What's crazy is that if it was just a rare joker that said times two, people would be losing their minds. They'd be like, it's a must take. But then like one that is times 1.5 is like... Excuse me, human resources. Let's just try to beat this ante, okay? Let's enhance our deck. Wheel is always, it's always tempting, don't get me wrong. It's always tempting. Even cards will be slightly better, sure. All right. I mean, we got a really good start. If I'm gonna keep it a buck 50 with you. I just don't know how well it scales, but I mean, like, that, we, we're clearing this by 10x. Oh, you're right. Polychrome on the right, too. Um, I, I, may, my toxic trait is that I think Hallucination is actually great if you don't have another spot for a Joker. Look at that. Paid for itself immediately. I would love to convert you, you, and you to hearts. It seems like we're running a hearts build right now just because we got one sun card before a world card. And then why don't you become uh, so lucky, become a star, and you cry, cry, cry for your lonely heart. Whoops. I'm discarding. Wait, what do I care? <laughs> We're fine. This game has so many dopamine triggering events, it's insane. It is, uh, I mean, local thunk, I don't know if you're here. You knocked it out of the park. There's nothing else that needs to be said. They're here. That's awkward now. I hate, dude, it's like, well, I, I can relate, okay? Because I'm also a big shot. I'm also a very important person, as you know. Um, sometimes I'll, like, go to a streamer's chat and I'll just, like, answer a question. And then, like, 50 people go, NL! Pog! And then, like, the streamer might not even know who I am, but they're like, whoa, oh, whoa, NL in the chat. And I gotta be like, hi. I'll shut up. I'm sorry. Like, it's just, like I didn't... I, 
I didn't. But now, like, the opposite is also coming true. Now Squeaks is so goaded with it. When I go into Squeaks chat and I type, nobody laughs at my jokes just because I'm the person who told them. It used to be, like, back in the day, I'd pop into Squeaks' chat and just be like, hello, and people would be like, hello, I can't. Now I go into Squeaks' chat and I'm like, I'm typing gold in there and people are just going, day one, day one. You know, like, come on, man. Listen, boys, I do like Burnt Joker. We could discard spade flushes and play it. We could discard any flushes. But then if we discard, it makes Banner worse. Banner, 40 chips, 40 chips. Do we care? We care a little bit. Eternal Joker, it's tough. It's a tough, it's eternal. It sucks because it's eternal. Thanks for the devil card, AKA thanks for nothing. I think we don't take. Can you sing me the song you sang this morning? Are you trying to get me demonetized? Because it's working. Um, you're talking about, I mean, I didn't sing it to you, just to be clear. I sang it for chat. It was uh, Alanis Morissette's One Hand in My Pocket. And it's like, um, I'm home and I'm gooning. I'm hard, but I can't quite come. I'm a shower, but it's frigid, baby. And what it all comes down to is that everything's gonna be fine, fine, fine. Cause I got one hand on my ball sack and the other one is tickling my asshole. You could see it, right? Hey, local dog, thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. Good timing on that one. Thank you. Appreciate it. I do. I do. He does, people. He does. Might as well play it, I suppose. <clears throat> New ringtone just dropped. Are you like a, a 19 year old British kid in 2008? You crashed your bus? Nah, I was getting ready to sell it anyway. Mm, fuck. Thank you. Thank you for your support, Jupiter me. Hmm, I can't take an eternal joker. I'm sorry. I just, it, it cannot be done. I would rather run zero molts than take an eternal joker that I, I don't need. Hopefully. That's why they call me Mr. Glass. And they do, people. They do call me Mr. Glass. Donald Trump, if he played Mr. Glass the way M. Night Shyamalan originally wanted... Bruce, Bruce, you should know that that's why they, my bones, Bruce, they're not good bones. They used to be good bones. They're no longer good bones. The bones, they <laughs> shatter like glass. My skin is like tissue paper. It tears is what I'm trying to say. Justice. Okay. Aces. Retrigger. Um, listen, we're playing literally only flushes. So sure, let's take Supernova for now. Have you ever seen a more embarrassing build than this? 10 flushes and zero of everything else? That is pretty bad. <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> appreciate it. Use me. How about a spades flush while we're here? We're pogging. I mean, that's the deck. Yeah, it would checker deck. Checker deck is like Azazel. You take it and then you go like, you know, this is just what we're doing today. You, you lost on your last run. You go Azazel deck. I think we got to take hologram, man. Having some extra molted molt. I love it. Set my watch to that shit. You only sell for a dollar? It is tempting to get a spectral. To get a spectral Andrew. But I say we wait. 
Wait, did we get confirmation? Did you just confirm live in my chat? This is a big scoop for me. Did you just confirm live in my chat, Balatro coming to mobile? This is a big scoop. Please make sure you attribute that quote to me when you write about it. No, I did not. Never mind. Please leave my name out your mouth. I don't want to be associated with spreading misinformation. We go next. I mean, it's an, it's an easy build right now, no doubt about it. It's confirmed for Wii U. That's huge. That's a huge get. Finally, one good Wii U game. Hey, 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 hey. Zombie U had some interesting ideas. Give me red seal on a card that it benefits. Kate, I've been there many times. You're going to say Ben where? Well, what I thought just happened is you typed Keck W and then did autocomplete, but then it didn't autocomplete with the good Keck W. Instead, it did like the twisted metal Keck W. It happens in Dan's chat all the time because Dan is, uh, I guess he's trying to sell his own emotes. He has his own version of Keck W. Then I pop into his chat, I type Keck W and it auto completes to that and straight up, I just close the tab. I'm like, I'm out of here. I've embarrassed myself. All right, let's see how we're cooking up here. <laughs> Same thing happens. If I go into somebody's chat and I type Pog and I hit tab enter before seeing what's gonna get played, or what, what, what's going to get shown, I should say. And then it brings up the Komodo hype. I'm like, I'm out of here. I get it. Don't get me wrong. I completely understand. But I will not be caught dead dropping a Komodo hype in someone's chat. It's just not going to happen. Hearts get molted. And C's get degrees. It's good though. No, Komodo hype. I hate to say it, Komodo hype is kind of cringe. I consider it kind of cringe. You can do whatever you want. This is some point in our lives. We might enjoy something like that. What if your kid did it? Yeah, this doesn't make the point that you think it makes, though. In fact, it makes my point easier. 34-year-old men with beards doing what my three-year-old daughter does, like sharing that behavior, that's cringe. <laughs> that might even be the easiest test if something is cringe. We are a heart's flusher, you know what? I mean, at some point... Librarian, are you watching this? How do I get my money up? I'm a little embarrassed in myself here. Like, that was horrible. Why'd you have to body that guy? Listen, okay? This is not my first rodeo. I've been taking blows from all comers for quite some time. Pivot to better hands than flush. Anybody else got ideas? <laughs> yeah, local thunk. Can you patch me in a little bit more money, please? All face cards are drawn face down. I guess I got to fully commit to the economics of the situation. You simply must be a heart. <clears throat> you must be a heart. It's that simple. Mm. 
with only one hand, we definitely need the retrigger. Even though we got the guaranteed flush. Oh, that's spicy though. <laughs> we come on. Come on. No! Okay, we go again. We go again. <clears throat> okay, how about some score this time? Hollow, hollow, a hollow, hollow, hollow. Sure, we go hollow. We go again. Listen, we're not going to be too picky about it. Banner's a bad pickup. Okay, local thunk. Can you take some feedback from the chat? When I'm playing the game and I get a, a polychrome joker in the first shot, please do not give me a banner. That's not fair. Now, okay. All right. You know what? Apology accepted. They said live patching in chat, and they are not joking. They didn't joke in the slightest. Sure, you know what? How about two of these square boys? <laughs> the problem is now we have to play four cards. So we can't really flush, but... I think it, it'll, it'll be worth it. Okay, now we should settle down. We should have played some high cards on that. Oh, 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 why? I can't take it. It 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 plays against the rest of my deck, and I don't have the money to begin with. But okay, listen. Here we save money for a bit. We're we're straight chilling. You got nothing to worry about. We can literally throw Dookie, and and they'll thank us for doing it. I mean, I'm straight up going like Princes of Maine, Kings of New England with this shit. If we have to, we play a flush at the end. <laughs> hold, everybody hold, hold. I mean, we're, we're there. But now we're really there. God, the pants would go crazy, bro. Oh, I only played three cards on the last one. No, thank you. I don't really get the strat. Um, hang on, four bucks for a joker kind of goes silly. <laughs> Every time you play a four card hand, This gains four more chips that apply to every single hand. And it's polychrome, so times 1.5. And it's duplicated. Pants Packet is on its way. Thank you. Pants Packet has been deployed. Steady. Perfect. I'll be straight up with you. I want to have enough money to buy the ante. So... I'm playing two pair. We do need the one thing we need a flat molt would go insane. Oh, that's a pair. Steady. Are you joking on me, bro? That's a huge hand. <laughs> Actually, that was still totally fine. What a world we live in. Huge. Okay, this is going to the moon. Pants coming in hot at 10 bucks. Here we go. Wait, I've only got six. Imagine, though. Imagine. Okay, now we go economics pilt. Double tag polychrome. No, 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 no. Don't even worry about all of that. Okay? Step one. 
we have enough. We want to we want to win slower and build up these square jokers, okay? Because we don't make money on this one. Well, we kind of make money on this one anyway. The this is the difficult part of the game where we're trying to obscure our power level, but don't obscure it too much. <laughs> I don't get it. I forgot I have one less hand. Yeah, don't obscure it too much. Okay, just be careful. We go next? No, no, no. That's not what we need. Play two pairs. Psychedelic Gazelle. Thank you for the gifted subscriptions, by the way. Thank you. 64 chips. Not bad. When we get this flat molt, brother, it's we're going to the stratosphere. I put it in the jumbo buffoon pack. Don't lie to me, brother. I'm to I you're just trying to tease me. I know that it's about to show up in this next shop and it's going to be foil that's not as good as polychrome but you've already been very nice to me so far so i'm not going to worry about all of that oh i have to play a hand Motherfuck. <laughs> queen jack four two Oh, okay. We made it. Just play a straight. Bro, how would my jokers feel about that? Probably pretty bad. Listen, 14 bucks goes insane. Three of a kind can at least hit with four. No wheel? You wait, you you pump the wheels later, bro. You put you pump the wheels later. Four of a kind could go insane. Roll. Planets and celestial packs are free. I mean, I guess for a for a for a second, why not? Gives a free spectral pack. But then we get less opportunity. Spectral pack's pretty good though. Destroy a random card? I would love to add three enhanced face cards. We need good cards in this deck. Now, those are not the best, but it's something. 10-10-2-2. Ten, ten, two, two. We, we need to increment two pair, okay? If we could get uh, the voucher that... Oh, that wasn't even that good. <laughs> okay, I'll tell you what. How about queen, queen, three, four, five... Then we have a pair in our flush. So we're getting eight molt off of that, Andrew. We need we need a flat molt. It doesn't have to be pants, but we need flat molt. Adds number of times poker hand has been played the molt. In normal. That's enormous mode. I guess. I guess we can afford to add good cards. A gold card. I, I wipe my ass with it. No disrespect, local thunk. No disrespect. Listen. That's horrible. It's horrendous. Two pair is the way. Two pair is the way. Lock in. I'm locked in. I'm locked in. Look, it's like oh, supernova before polychrome. It's it. it oh, I see. It isn't. <laughs> I'm locked in. I'm locked in. I'm being accused of not being locked in, but I'm locked in. By the celestial first, two free planets is kind of crazy mode. I don't even play flush. Why would I buy that? <laughs> Pants are in the pack, trust. No, it's not your fault if they're not, but I was gonna open it anyway, so. Four of a kind, 300 chips, useless. It's useless, unfortunately. So we go next. Create two common jokers, we won't be doing that. We'll be going rare joker. I mean, I, I see, we need pairs. Fours are good. Sixes are fine, sevens are fine, eights are bad.
I don't know why I'm discarding my best cards. I guess I thought the game would just give me worse cards. In which case, so be it. We only have two discards in this, huh? Rude. Very rude indeed. Four jacks, two aces. Obviously, you're gone. Sometimes help comes from a place where you least expect it. Pants. <laughs> I can't, but I must. Okay, free Celestial pack does go crazy. Maybe we will be playing three of a kinds at some point. My problem here is that you do add flat malt, but I can't keep it and astronomer. We won't be taking this. I think this sucks ass. Robber's good. You're actually completely correct. Robber kind of goes crazy for us right now. Three extra hands for the cost of two discards is nothing, bro. And then the rare joker. The rare joker. So all you have to do is very simple. You simply draw two pair. <laughs> he gets on base. Money Balatro. Now this time, we're just not messing around. Too much. Yes, I'm building my Joker now. Now that now that we have some, well, I guess we don't have to. <laughs> I, I, if high card four or whatever I just played. Oh, fuck you, man. Fuck you, dude. I'm working my ass off here. That wasn't four cards. Sometimes I don't like to make it too easy on myself is the thing. Lock in? No, I'm having fun. That's huge. Huge. Don't need it. Need it. Need it more than anything else. Then? Oh, you can't discard. You're right. <laughs> well, at some point, I'll be able to again. Do it. Hook me up, bro. No specialties? No specialties? What a, what a damn scam. I'm getting, I'm getting detritus, man. It's trash. A, a double skip. This is a great opportunity to build Supernova and Square Joker. It's also a great opportunity to, you know, have your score hopefully be high enough to know that you're safe. There you go, there you go. And then we got our two pair right there, so you play four cards. Okay, discard me. Are you familiar with the Mayan number zero? On God, like if we're being, being sincere here, I don't think we care about four fingers. It's not a scoring mult. We need, a, we need another flat mult enabler. That's huge. Nah, man, that's, that's fool's gold. That's uh, playing Super Smash Brothers against level five bots and then challenging Ludwig. We're, we're two pair pilled. We literally can't play flushes or straights at this point or, or we'll lose because we'll lose 14 mult on every play. It's too late. It's too late. We need steel. Let's put it on fours. Well, let's put it on aces. We need steel. We gotta figure out how we're getting past the needle. That helps. <laughs> Funny, but I don't think so. Ah, how delightful. Appreciate you, what you've done for me, but you don't help us on the needle. This is insanely important, especially with the polychromes. We're not, well, we are working with the duo now that I think about it. Now the chariot, more steel probably beats more malt. So let's buy but not use. Especially if we're going long term. Now, do we have two pair? Yes. Malt them. 
steal you. Whatever, just go with the ace, bro. No, that's gonna molt, right? My mistake. <laughs> Still gonna be pretty good. Son of a gun. You know what? That's why I brought my own. Yo, new tech. <laughs> well, now that we have discards, I think there's no choice. You must duplicate this Andrew. Giving us more tarot cards. Man refuses to lock in. I'm not in charge of the banana, bro. What do you think I am? Dr. Potassium? I don't have control over that. So I'm, I'm getting slandered out here for stuff that's beyond my control. All right, this is a tight spot, I'll admit. 32 grand. Discarding a pair off the, off the jump is a little spooky. Three hearts. We definitely snooze that. We're so back. <clears throat> Discarding a pair is crazy. Yo, but it got us this awesome sun card. And look, we're straight chilling anyway. Who knew? Who knew? Is the Coke Zero arc over? Why, Red Toe? Are you looking into uh, Dividend Aristocrats right now? I need a Judgment card. That's what we need right now. We got one. It has to be done. It's so insanely ass. <laughs> okay, Uranus. I can't roll. I can't, and I'm not taking these. I can't afford them, bro. I'm not skipping. I'm not skipping. So start with two pair. Obviously. My econ's all screwed up, bro. It's all right. The square jokers will get us. I don't know why I'm moving it. <laughs> We can't afford to burn a discard. I almost always say we can. This is like the rare situation where we can't. How about a judgment? No judgment. I can't afford a Wheel of Fortune with pure ass in my hand. We gotta make some bonus cards, bro. It's the only way. You're due though? All right. That's why I'm not mad at you. I, I made, I am of sound mind and I, when I made that decision. I was not making the decision under duress. My name is twitch.tv slash northern lion. I, I am in sound, I, I said the word wrong. It would have been a good bit though. <clears throat> we go next, we have to go next. We have no choice but to go next. Okay, we can only play one type of hand. What do we have lots of? We do have lots of jacks. Keep your bonus cards. I need the tarot card. It gives us a wheel of fortune. Imagine, brother. Imagine. Nope. That would have been pog, though. Well, you're not getting rid of kings. So you're telling me there's a chance. We, we need to get two pair on every single hand, I think. We need to get at least one more two pair. The problem with playing a straight is that when we play two pair, we get 20 molts times 1.5 times 1.5 times two. So how many fours? There's three fours, three sixes, two sevens, two eights, two nines, two aces. Godspeed, gamers. Suck me. 
You also can't because of the boss blind. Fair enough, fair enough. Bro, this boss blind is tough. They're not joking around with this guy. This is the one. Local thunk. I'm assuming that my... Um, two double tags already. I'm assuming that my... Uh, my uh, pants are in the mail. And also, I would say I am owed, backdated with penalties and interest, approximately three consecutive wheels. Whoops. <laughs> three consecutive wheel payouts, please. I have to buy something. Brother, maybe you can make it work with a spectral. It might be better than a, a garbage joker. You make polychrome aces and then find a way to duplicate them. Watch this. <laughs> Come on. I need some big cards, bro. I need some big boys. Foil queen, steel queen. Red Seal Ace, we take those, and a Wild Jack. Polychrome Steel? I don't know what to do. Red Seal Steel, Polychrome. Okay, we have none Jokers, right? But we got some great cards that we did not draw. But imagine if we did hold the Ace. <laughs> polychrome 5, that's also Steel in Mama Liz's chili oil. It is so not over. You have no vision. <laughs> Hang on, guys. We might be cooked. Easiest thing to conceive of is a flush. Two steel cards. Hold. This is a holdable situation. I got one more in me. Buy some freaking jokers. So there's a chance. <laughs> there's a chance. I'm making four bucks. Just give me anything, man. Anything. <laughs> it's trash. It's trash, man. I can't take either. I'm not getting a straight. Maybe I have to go for a straight. I don't know. Jumbo Arcana, hope there's a judgment. Fuck it, bro. Fuck it. Help. Help me. It's so doable. Guys, it's so doable. We're gonna have to play the queen anyway. We're gonna have to play the queen. We might as well save it because we gotta play a queen. We gotta. I, I hate to dump a steel card. I, I do. I do. I do. I do. But we gotta. We gotta play it at some point anyway to make the straight. Oh, seven, eight, nine, Jack, you motherfucker, you. Dump him. Dump him. One good straight gets us there. I lived, bitch. Okay, we literally... We can only play straights, bro. I'm gonna be discarding like a madman, but we can only, we can only play straights. You know what? Sell, sell me for two bucks. Buy the buffoon pack. Get something better. Oh, brother. <laughs> it's, it's nothing. The jokers don't do anything. I mean, we're not gonna be able to afford a rare joker. We, we gotta... We gotta burn this out, man. At least I feel like I, I can play other hands now, but is this hand even gonna be close? It's gonna 2x our molt. Who freaking cares, man? 252? <laughs> 
Fuck that. That's not happening. <laughs> I'm over that one. We go next. That shit is insulting. Okay, from now on... Flush build. That's uh, You know what? I'll, I'll play nice with you. Maybe we'll aim for a straight flush. <clears throat> that, that, you're right. That quit was self-care. I'm a simple man. I do like a fortune teller. But the choice between an eternal fortune teller or a buffoon pack, we take those. Listen, boys. <laughs> I've been running that a lot today. Mega Arcana is kind of crazy, though. Let us... I'm going to turn this three into a lucky card. Because this. I'm telling you right now, this is going to be a hack red seal three build. The three is going to become a lucky Andrew. And then the king is going to copy the three. So shall it be ridden, so shall it be done. Can't play jacks. Dump them. Well, you know what? Maybe we shouldn't be stupid about it. Why not the five? We get in the mentions over a, over a two-chip difference, brother. Two chips. People are scoring into the Avogadro's numbers. Excuse me, waiter. I ordered Avogadro's number of uh, lettuce molecules. I, there appear to be two missing. Can you conceive of the insanity of this? Okay, how about a joker that m molts our malt? Well, okay, now hang on. It's a joker that molts our malt. And then if we could enhance some cards, mayhaps. I mean, <laughs> you're due? Listen, you're right. Fuck. I should have known, man. I shouldn't. I should have known. It's all right. Never play face cards. We don't play face cards. We know this. You could keep your aces and just play flushes. Decent straight flush potential as well. Okay. Problem is, we need we need a way to duplicate enhanced cards. There's a number of different ways that this could come to pass. One way is DNA, if it shows up. Hello, Mouth, by the way. Hello. Another way would be buying a lot of tarot cards. I don't know. For right now, we're comfortable. We're comfortable right now. Just please do not play queen cards. You are not G-Idol and you never will be. Let that sink in. Molt me for this, Andrew. I would have loved to. I would have... You know what? Let, give me a second here. I love it. I, creating more tarots is going to go crazy. Because tarots can then create two enhanced cards. Clubs debuffed. Who cares? Nobody. He's K pop pilled? I owe it all to my wife, honestly. I would know very little K pop if it were not for her. And you know, it's not like uh, I'm an indiscriminate K pop enjoyer. There are K pop songs I listen to and I say, I like that one. I feel like Dash by Nmix kind of goes crazy. Let me guess. I played four cards. Yep. <laughs> Very simple. Dump it. We literally can't play. Oh, we can play the king as long as we play. Oh, but then it plays a flush. <laughs> it is what it is, brother. This this time, this is a genuine intentional. Oh, could, could you just... Shut up for a second with this. Lock in. We're so back. <clears throat> Told you. Okay. 
What was I saying? Oh, yeah. I forgot. Some K-pop I listen to and I say that's not for me. Sometimes I listen to it and I go, you know what? That is for me. We have to build econ. We have to build econ. We have to focus a little bit. Thoughts on new jeans? Probably the most asked question in my chat over the last several years, apart from uh, why are you breathing so loud? Pause champ. I like them. I, I'm going to say the same thing. I like that, that they've got the Sega Dreamcast pause music. Sixteen spades, fifteen hearts, and a diamond. But I, I can't, I can't play the cards. I can't play the cards, man. I can't play the cards. But I, I, I have to. I have to do something. I can't do anything. Play three of them. Yeah, but then we get rid of ride the bus, bro. This is insane. We have to play all four, in my opinion. Draw an ace. The ace at least lets us toss four cards. Three cards. And then all you have to do is... There's only one way out, boys. There's only one way out. Two pair. <laughs> I would love a Joker. Okay, Baron has a certain je ne sais quoi. Step one is root for the spade flush. Good start. A hard flush with a king in hand. Very nice. I think we did take one king out of our deck, which is kind of... No, maybe we didn't. Maybe that was last run before I held R. Nine bucks. Well, we're probably not going to be playing a straight. Give me the Mega Arcana. I think we're screwed, man. <laughs> Even with all we got going on, I still think we're toasted. Hearts are debuffed. That's extremely unfortunate. Especially when you see what the fuck we drew, man. <laughs> oh, man, we drew seven hearts. That's got a sting. Easy discard, though. Okay. You play this. Just hold. This is not. It's not cooked. All right. Don't play the king. Yeah, that was a good point, actually. Now is kind of cooked. I need you to draw a spade, please. Wait, this still works on the on the king that's in hand? Even though it's debuffed? No, no, it doesn't. It just looks... Okay, they're really... Dude, they're giving me a chance. <laughs> it's not going to make it, but... It is going to make it! Holy! We drew five spades on the last one. We've cruelly been kept alive for absolutely no reason. Hey, how about a Joker that fucking does something? Okay, check this out. Popcorn will keep us alive for a couple minutes. That's, that's something. That is something. Uh... Justice me to help out Hemomancer. Can't afford a rare Joker. Honestly, might be pogging up over two common Jokers. As sad as it is. Hold your kings in hand whenever possible. My word. You're going to see Dune 2 in theaters? I don't think it's going to happen. I would like to. It's just a real hassle.
doing two of your moms at the same time? I don't have time to do that either, honestly. <laughs> Go by yourself. You got the. It, it's a different. Uh, it's a different sort of issue. It's more of a time issue than anything else. Oh, good. All face cards are debuffed. Thanks. I really appreciate it. I never get to use the kings, man. Just go instead of working. My ass is not taking a day off from work to go see a movie in the theater. That's uh, that's just not going to happen. Hear me out here. Because video games are more fun than movies. What if you fish for a straight flush? We only get one more discard. Imagine if it goes wrong. <laughs> Why did you take square? Aren't you playing flushes? Why are you commenting when you've clearly joined the stream in the last 45 seconds? This came from a skipped blind, okay? I had no choice but to take it. Now, if it would, if it would please you, I could sell it, but I might need these 16 chips, bro. I think we got a flush. You flush holding an ace so you can use the ace to play face cards and get them out of your hand. Thankfully, that didn't become an issue on this one. You discard, discard, discard. Ace. Queen, seven. Come on, England. <laughs> High card. No, a pair, a pair, a pair. We need help, man. I got no money, no, no jobs, no hope, no cash. Come on, man. Listen, for four bucks, give me this. But first, <laughs> get out of there. No, I'm due. <laughs> they keep telling me I'm due. We can get 18,000. Imagine it hit the popcorn. That would be good though, because then at least it would have hit something, you know? I would have gotten some benefit out of it instead of none benefit. We got real issues. I mean, this run is getting nothing off the ground. But don't get it twisted. This is blue steak, you know? This is like, uh, it's the kind of thing that like a 19-year-old orders in a steakhouse when they consider themselves classy. But, but instead of knowing their order, they have to Google like, what does classy dude order at steakhouse? Let's be realistic out here. Blue steak is not a good order. Rare, sure. Nothing wrong with that. Okay, here's the play. I need to draw two hearts. Okay, a pair gets us there. No, it doesn't. But honestly, we go. Honest, I think we let's leave blue steak for now. This has been like two hours of misery. Okay, give me a real run. I've been hitting my head against the wall on that one. Give me the anaglyph deck. It's fun, it, uh, but not. Excuse me. Red stake difficulty, please. Oh, green stake difficulty? Give me a deck that is good that I haven't won much with. How about, how about a simple red stake blue deck? I'll not be doubling my money. But now I gotta turn my head on because I can't just play uh, I can't just play flushes all the live long day, at least not yet. Hello, Sinvicta, hello. Blue eyes, white snake, dragon. Blue eyes, white snake, dragon my nuts. I don't know what I was, what I was thinking with that one, honestly. 
Listen, I'm a simple man. At some point, I would love clearance sale. What was the other one? I think like I would love clearance sale. I would love this, and I would love this. I think they're all good. Let's let's start with the club. That's a double tag. There's no way we're getting ten bucks. So honestly, I think you skip. You accept that you're not getting the ten piece. And then we aim to play clubs. We play to win the game. We play to win the game is the thing. The interesting thing about this one. Okay. Tell you what. Three of those, Andrews. It's good enough. <laughs> Would you eat a 10 piece? Interesting, but not long term. I would eat a 10 piece uh, essentially any day of the week. Wow. I would eat them in a car and I would eat them in a bar. I would eat them on a plane. We should be so lucky. I would eat them on a train. Did you guys like my Jay Leno joke this morning as well? I'm, I, like, I, I'm sorry to just fish for your approval, but... Uh, in response to Wendy's surge pricing, McDonald's has announced that it's going to follow suit next year. Experts expect that it, an Egg McMuffin ordered at 10.59 a.m. could cost as much as $10,000. I thought it was pretty good. Meh. Mm, McDonald's jokes, huh? I would like to enhance a card and then use death to copy it next time. I would love, do you think we can afford a rare, two rare jokers? Do you think we can afford some rare jokers, bro? <clears throat> Why'd you only do one? That's a good point. That's a good point. That's a good point. A, you've made an excellent point. Now listen. I think I'm just worried about the double glass here. Why not? Wait, it doesn't matter. That's what you want. You want more clubs at some point. 10 Jack Queen King Ace with the Jack on the right. If it's going to break, we might as well get the score. Didn't break. Fantastic. Surge pricing at a restaurant. End of civilization shit. You know what? what annoys me I just think baseball cards more fun honestly me five years ago definitely would have been like um yeah but you're not considering the other aspect of surge pricing that means that instead of paying 5.99 for your combo you know if you go at non-peak hours you might pay like 475 but me 10 years later and jaded I'm like nah man not gonna happen <laughs> that's <laughs> That's not how that's going to work. Historically speaking, at least. And a golden seal. I would love to destroy a random non-club in my hand and add three enhanced clubs. That was actually, at least it's three of the same kind, bro. Hi, buddy. You okay? <laughs> I really thought that would be a lot better than that. That was a heck of a meow. I guess I decided this card was pretty good for some reason. This run will actually go to eight. I, I apologize that we're running flushes again, but I feel like I got back on the horse. I feel like I got timed. Oh no, it's extra large blind. <laughs> Hi, Tomo. Hi, buddy. It just sucks because clubs are the hardest suit to draw I needed like even a little more than that which is kind of crazy okay this is how we play how I play the game. I'm, I'm dumping a gold card. We need all the support we can get. Clubs are not hard to draw. Listen, brother, it's the hardest suit to draw 
in a normal deck of cards. Diamonds, I mean, it's like, come on. If you can draw a square, you can draw a diamond. Hearts, one of the basic shapes. It's contained within Lucky Charms. Spades, it's literally just a, a club with less detail. It's an unfocused club. This one is easy. We save for Econ first. Once our Econ is sorted, we go nuclear on the purchases. I said nuclear. We have a discard. How droll, Niles. Hmm. Eight, ten, seven, eight, ten, Jack, Queen, King. Dipped in Mama Liz's Eat My Shit Oil. 710 King. Dip, please, I can't. It's, uh, I've been infected by the mind virus. You're, you're cooking me. And for what, man? You really don't have any clubs left in this deck? Oh my god, they, there was one club left in the deck. Has anyone checked on how Mama Liz feels about the bit? Listen, boys, four bucks for an uncommon Joker, maybe. <laughs> uh, now we can play, we can play pins, pains, and clubs, bro. Polychromy, 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 polychromy. If we get a polychrome uncommon, it's my life for ire, boys. Let's dump it. It's too, it's too risky. I ain't got time to bleed. One in seven cards get drawn face down. So it turns out that was a freaking lie. One in one cards gets drawn face down. That's huge. Thank you. I really appreciate that. It is a great time to have discards. Come on. Come on. Juice me up a little bit. You're going to juice me up. Now. Oh, that's right. We don't have to make flushes anymore. We can make full houses. You son of a bitch. I can't. Listen. It's. This is snake oil, man. You can't. You can't do it. We gain one hand per round. You can't. You can't do it. Just take it. Why are you being weird? You can't. Am I taking crazy pills? You can't do it. Okay, take me back to rank sorting. This is a flush draw. This is the way. Don't break. I need all the help I can get. I also need to get my econ sorted, but I can't help but buying things. That wasn't even that good. We got lots of hands. It's actually totally fine. Blurred Joker? You're right. Smeared Joker would go kind of crazy on this one. We discard too much. We go next, we rebuild the economics of the system. We can only play one hand, bro. We're in trouble. We need to buy a Joker. What is this shit? I don't have a good feeling about this one. Okay, never mind. I'm feeling okay again. Discard, discard. It's so nice to have discards, man. Oh, never mind. <laughs> what? <clears throat> okay, we're going to put this high contrast card thing to bed, all right? 
Because now we're getting comments like, hey, and I love the content, but it would be really nice if you enabled high contrast cards. I've been dodging the question for about a week and a half. I'm not turning it on because I think it looks worse. You're gonna make me the bad guy, then make me the bad guy for that, beat me to death with hammers. I just don't think it looks, when I tune into it, it doesn't stop me from tuning into the stream. But when someone is has the high contrast cards on, I'm like, I don't like it. I don't like it as much. I like I like it the way it is. I do understand that it, it sucks for the people that have trouble delineating. I also have trouble delineating, but that's more of like a brain issue than a, than a rods and cones thing. It just for me, I don't I don't like the the blues and the. I like the way I like the way it looks right now. Now, trust me, I would have rather not said anything. But people keep asking. <laughs> so, at some point, you gotta... Hang on. We're so in. 8, 9, 10, Jack, Queen. 8, 9, 10, Jack, Queen. Holy... If you discard a Royal Flush, you unlock an S-tier Joker. This is the rare spoiler that is the greatest spoiler I've ever heard. I never would have discovered it for myself. Thank you. That's incredible tech. Fool me. Which makes a death card. <laughs> Which we already had in there. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Uh, you're uncommon. You are uncommon. That's an interesting way to consider it. Flush. We do be flushing. Okay, you know what? There's some hope. Can only play one hand. <laughs> Go. Copy me. We got good multiplications. We don't need another glass. I have upgraded high card, but listen, you gotta do what you gotta do. How about like a how about like a freaking flush house or something, bro? I think this hand is good enough, but we might as well discard still. Just see what you're what you're working with. King, king, king. Eight jack flush with the with the glass on the end. A little overkill, but we take those. Listen, Jack. We want the voucher. We have like none scaling though. This kind of still like pure ass. So hear me out. I'm gonna go absolutely insane. Uh, no, I'm not. Yes, I am, boys. Yes, I am. <laughs> what are you talking about? I don't know yet. I'm playing straight mud, okay? I'm playing garbage. Why? My ass is getting too cute with it. I want to discard a flush so that we can level up flush via burnt joker. Bad idea? I know. Unless... Unless it's the greatest idea any human being has ever had in history because we have so many hands and so many discards. Permanently gain one hand. <laughs> Playing with fire is probably how the card got burned. You know what? When you're right, you're right. And in this situation, I think you're definitely right. Here's a little pair for you. Here go two more for y'all. How about a club? Oh, you shouldn't have. We're so back. Seven hands. My boy's a tarantula. You know, I'm going to plus two you on that one. Now, you're going to say we're very close to a heart flush. And you're right. Hearts don't get my blood pumping, though. They don't get my blood pumping. 
clubs get my spades get my blood pumping. Spades get my blood pumping. Hmm. <laughs> Delightful. Yes. Give me the money, Lebowski. And none of them broke. Hearts don't get my blood pumping. I, I see what you're saying now. Hey, check this out, okay? Low card flushes dipped in Mama Liz's chili oil via the hack. I'm just going to be real with you. On this one, we're not fucking around because we only get to draw three cards. We'll go seven, eight, nine, ten, jack. Play a straight with a little bit of glass on top of it dipped in Mama Liz's chili oil. Discard one card. Two, three, four, five, six. We have some cookery. We don't like hearts. We might like Jumbo Arcana. I don't think we need it yet, though. No repeat hand types. I don't want to die. <laughs> hmm, not ideal. Check this shit out, bro. Six, seven, eight, nine. That's not. A, that's not what we want. We do. We'll, we'll play a pair because we want to discard a flush. Oh, brother! Come on, just give me a spade, man. There's there's billions of them in the deck. Now we're talking. Oh, I played it. <laughs> you know what? Maybe we shouldn't mess about then. We got four discards left. Forget about Burnt Joker on this one. Just, just go for it, man. Just go for it. Just go for it. Just send it. You know what? If that's what they want, that's what they'll fucking get. Take one of those. Some capital. Mm, the trio, not my tempo. We must go next. I don't think I'm getting the 70,000 without a little Joker help. Now we're talking. Okay, play a pair. We have an easy spade flush to discard. What did I freaking tell you? Discard the Goldie. Save the this one. You may need it. You may not, but you may. Discard me. Thank you so much. Two glass jokers. It's a little spicy, I'll admit. Because if we lose these, like, we may need them on later antes, but... Being alive also goes crazy. 14 free dollars. Start with the Jumbo Arcana. This is a big moment for us, okay? Wheel of Fortune. Oh, foil me. <laughs> it's not really that good, but it's something. I think we may have to say Burnt Joker goes. But it's uncommon. But you're uncommon. You're all uncommon. You're, mm, maybe nothing goes. Maybe you, maybe you buy a flush enabler. How many blanks have you unlocked? I don't know. About like a, a thousand. You get bullied into buying it like every single time it comes up, even if it's fiscally a horrible decision. I'm just trying to win, man. I gotta think about this for a second. There you go. There you go. Emperor. These are two very valuable cards for the battle. Okay, I understand what we must do. We gotta play like a straight flush. First. Tough choice. It's a very tough choice. 
I think a wild low card would go crazy. We're two clubs, three spades. Sorry to the clubs, even though there's a glass Andrew there. Now, a wild five seems like it goes nutty. Because it'll get... No, 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 I'm wrong. <clears throat> Sorry. A molted five goes crazy. Because it'll get triggered twice by the hack. That's the way. You don't need uh, repeat hand types if you just win in one hand, boys. Plus one hand size. Next round. One random joker disabled every hand. Honestly, if you disable my uh, burnt joker, that actually might be to my benefit. <laughs> Please just let me get the anti-8. We've had such trash attempts for like the past two hours. Let me regain some confidence, please. Are you kidding me? You're not kidding me. You're not kidding me. Demi Royal Flush. Discarded high card? Son of a bitch. How's my high card doing, though? It is level five. So you're on common, but everybody else is on common, and I prefer them, so that's a problem for you. 75,000? 75,000 is so doable, man. Huge, huge. That's a flush. That's a flush. Dude, having many hands that are large is kind of huge. My glass cards have survived so much too. Holy cow. Now, this is where we need to go to the moon. More, more multis is very nice. I think we might have to like, ah, but we'd like to multi low card. So here's what you do. Here's what you do. You use a multi and you just pop it on some, some stuff you like to play. Then you use a fool. And you try to use it on hackable cards next. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then let's just see. Maybe you'll give me a better uncommon or a negative joker. Not better. We go next. What are you disabling? Okay, it would be nice to play spades. In this situation, one does not worry about one's burnt joker. You simply discard and get ready for your club flush. I mean your spade flush. You get dumped, 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 dumped. Dumped. <clears throat> dumped, dumped, and dumped. You discarded a spade. Maybe I should turn on high contrast cards. Discard me. You know what your problem is? <laughs> you never had faith. Ace, two, five, queen, king, all enhanced and yet all natural.
perfect sacrifice on a glass. Now, Endless is not looking good. But we at least got some confidence back. An extra discard goes insane! <clears throat> and we go next. 110,000. I wipe my ass with 110,000. Give me the spectral. Can't afford. There's 50% chance this helps us a little. There's only three red cards in there. Don't be a fool. We take those. We take those. Reroll boss blind. No, I'll spend my money down. Now the, the popping has officially begun. We're going to go clubs. Lucky me. Smeared Joker is uncommon too, right? Like Smeared Joker would go kind of insane. Wow. <laughs> okay. Okay. Can't afford to lose too many glass cards, but is this the God run? It isn't barring a miracle, but it is pretty good. It's the best run we've had in a couple hours at least, but I've been playing on higher stake difficulty for me at least as well. Um... I think we gotta look for like a better uncommon if possible. Doesn't exist. Doesn't exist. Ten molts doesn't exist. Next. Playing a flush. I didn't spend my money. <laughs> All right. Step one. Step one. You play this. This garbage. You dump it. You dump it, dump it, dump it, dump it, dump it. I played it. <laughs> okay, that's, I should probably... Oh, man, I should probably go eat something. Um, okay, I have an idea, though. Wait, 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 wait. My flush is at 18. Straight flush is at 8. No, no, no. You play, you play a regular flush. You're going to go king, king, king. You're going to put this at the end. Not worried about 30 bucks. I'm worried about 215,000 points. Guess what? Your ass is now wild. Please tell me wild counts as a spade and a club for triggering. Huge. It does indeed. It does indeed. How about that? Okay, we're back. Econ destroyed. Um, so simply put, for you to have like any chance of going long term, you do need campfire. But it also probably kills us to take it because we'd sell Burnt Joker, buy campfire, have no money to buy sell, and we'd lose 1.5x mult. So I think we got to get our Econ crunching again, which is rough. Um, I, I genuinely think we have to skip once <laughs> and then there's a little prayer involved. Uh, the prayer would be first Wheel of Fortune. That's very helpful. And then at least some money. Um, that, that is helpful. It is, it's something. Now, I think we have to compete. I don't know if we're going to get 840,000, but if we can't get 840,000, we're definitely not getting a million. It would be nice to have, like, a club flush with a couple of hacks involved here. I'm kind of ignoring Burnt Joker. A club flush with one hack. Let's see how this, uh, this extra hollow is helping us out. Not impossible, but it's going to be a, it's going to be a big stretch. It's nice to have a steal. <laughs> Thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Dr. Ock! Dr. Ock! Yes, it must be. It must be Dr. Octopus. Thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. 
You're right, you're right. And when you're right, you're right. Nice little dump on that one. Really would be sick to get plus 20 mult on this. Okay, it did everything it could. It's, it's out of my hands now. We still have four hands, which is kind of insane. We're, we're gonna out, we're gonna draw through our whole deck. We're not gonna have enough. Wait, it, it, it's, oh, the cookery. Hey, Valentine, thanks for the gifted subscriptions as well. Thank you. Thank you. I didn't want to play my steel card, but I think the writing's on the wall here. Get thee to a nunnery. If you're interested, I don't know about all of that. Do we really not have a flush? That's got a sting. <laughs> well, yeah, I think we're, we're toasted on that one. How about a level three pair with a spade and a club? Not quite. We have one more hand. Oh my gosh. We have two more hands. Hang on, hang on, lock in. Play it, play it, play it. We can't not draw a flush. Four of a kind Andrews. No, flush is like times 18 molts. The flush. The flush is definitely in the building. Oh. <laughs> you know what? That's good timing. That's, we, it, it's a loss, but we made it to anti 10. That's a win, man. That's a win. Okay. Okay, we'll call it, I don't know, it's like Balatro 5. Let me see if Kate is ready to stream. Good ballot showing today. She's live already! See you tomorrow. Later!